are very stupid. You are stupid and you are very mad. In fact, you inherited the madness of your great, great, great grandfather. You are a fool. How dare you? How dare you touch my thing? Who told you to shift this papers? Why are you shifting it? Is it blocking for your destiny? Is the papers blocking you from taking it? Eh? Who told you to remove the papers from where I kept it? Enough for that. I'm sorry. I only shifted it so I can sweep that place. It, you see? You only shifted it. She doesn't get for Kwagoko. She doesn't get for Kwagoko. You are shifting it as who? You are shifting it as what? Do you know that because you have got this part, I will not wear it again. She doesn't come out with God forbid. I will not wear it again because I don't know if you have transferred the. You, your bad luck to the papers. Can you imagine? Other people come from their families into a new family. They grew up through job red. You bring evil spirit from Unanaga. Put it at this compound. Barren food and no fear. Oh, oh. In a pussy. Hey, hey, hey. In a thing, we. Are you squeezing your face? You are squeezing your face. Why now? Did I say anything with this name? Are you not barren? Are you not barren? Manyaga! Let me even ask you a small question. How many abortions have you committed? Guama will keep your secret for you. Eh? Only God knows how many abortions you have committed that kept you in this condition. Do you have room at all? Because I'm very sure that in the process of that abortion, maybe they have removed your womb. Because from where I am sighting this, your stomach, or don't go with it here, it looks very empty. It looks empty. All this noise that stomach that has something inside in me. Because your womb is as empty as your brain. I told you to leave my brother alone. I told you to go since you have you cannot perform a job but a one. By the time I finish with you, you will pack your bags by yourself and you will run away. You will not walk away. You will run away from this compound. Nya ima awa aso baga. Ona akobi na eko. Ai kolia. Rubbish. Foolish goats. Look at you. Ona bona anu kwa nabi my brother dey totoro. Fool. Did I do anything wrong to you? I was only trying to make this place clean. Uh -huh. So, by touching my papers, and I'm asking you again, why did you shift my papers? Is it blocking your destiny? Is it blocking your mood? Is it blocking you from taking it? Why did you touch it? But you are my only God in heaven. Only God in heaven will bear me witness that I was a virgin when your brother married me. How long? I'm only God will bear me witness. God, you have to vindicate me. Vindicate me because this is too much for me. This is too much of a load. I can't take it anymore. Why are you deceiving yourself? Look at who said my, my brother met her a baby. Why you Hey! Hey! Akudo! Why do you like deceiving yourself? How? Hey! Hey! Akudo! Abukan Makochi! I am an old hand in this game. We all know the work of Alam now. We know the miracle work of Alam. One drop, it will hire on your chair. Do you know how many men I got? Eh, you won't walk your own in church today. They met you a virgin. They met you a virgin in Mumbai. Go ask around. How many virgins are infertile? How many? Virgin or not, I know now Mumbai. Virginia, I don't blame you. It is me that went to package evil spirits into this compound. I blame myself a little. Hey! Look at the way this useless girl condemned this part. This is my best part. 
Because if I have one year, I will confirm you for what I have to do. Eh? It is better I lose it than to inherit the evil spirit from her great, great, great camp. I love you. People want to undermine the office of the first doctor in this compound. Many can't find a chance. It will not work. This home office has so near. It will be no transfer. It's alright. It's okay. Uh, hmm? uh, uh, My love, it's okay. It's not okay. It is not okay, Aham. It is either you take me far away, very far away from your sister, or I will run out of this marriage. You can't, you can't say that. I can't take it anymore. My love, because you can't say that. No? But what was the cause of this quarrel this morning between you and my sister? Yeah? What happened? I was sleeping in the front of the house. And then I removed Sister Wakeko's slippers just to sweep that place. Nothing more. Yeah. Sister Wakeko used all manner of evil words on me. Do you know that she even said that she will not use that slippers again because I must have transferred my ill luck to the slippers. <laughs> Just because I touched her slippers. Just because you tortured Nair's slippers. What kind, what kind of nonsense is this now? What kind of what kind of nonsense is this? <laughs> I know. It's alright. Okay? I, I'm sorry for what happened. As a matter of fact, I'm, I'm apologizing on behalf of my sister. Forgive her for my sake. You should understand her condition. You know what she's going through. She's a divorcee. That is why she's frustrated. Oh? Please, just forgive her for my sake. All right? Please, baby. Asam. Aham. Mm -hmm. Do you want me to continue living in this house with you as my husband? Uh -uh. Yes, no. You continue living with me forever. <laughs> I want you to continue living with me till death do us part. That is the vow we took now. Why are you asking me this kind of question? What happened? Please. I am pleading. Take me away from here. Take me away from this family house. The frustration is too much. The pressure from your sister will kill me. I am dying slowly. I am no longer myself. It's alright, it's alright. You'll be fine. My heart is shut what people? What people? Please, hold. how does it concern you? Whether my wife gives me children or not, how is it your business? I can see that you have fallen under Akudo's spell. Okuya, onye rireri. Erielege mecha popo. I can see that she has swallowed you with her wonder powers. Eh? A flav. Onye rireri, that is what you are. The way I am looking at you now, what I am seeing is a walking corpse. It will zoo my gige. Yes, when you want to gige, that's what you are. What can go? You yes. call me Alpha Mefuna, the only son of Mazanya, a walking corpse. I am ashamed of you. <laughs> I am ashamed of you. And you are very lucky, you are my only sister. If not, I will have sent you back to your husband's house. Are you mad? No wonder your husband divorced you and even seized your children. I'm ashamed of you. I am you ashamed of me. But you're not ashamed of poverty up there. Chineke Bogoko. I am a when you go walk wogo. I am a shoe mozo could be a gonna go sabo. May the ghost scatter that that useless mouth of 
obvious for vomiting that nonsense. Anyway, hmm, ah, let me make it very clear to you. A hundred of your ties cannot chase me out of my father's house. A wig on me. I can't do anything. Oh, it is now a competition. <laughs> eh? It is now a competition. Is that what you're trying to tell me? Why can't you go? Why can't you let the same girl you recommended for me, the same girl you forced me to marry, have peace in her husband's house? Why? What did she do to you? A slave. That is what you are. A your here. Thank God that that's your blockhead. Do you remember that I was the one who recommended her for you? And if I had known that that witch had eaten all the children in her womb, I wouldn't try it now. Mamu yawa. Mama de jafia patankwa ho. I will not try it. Okay. Let my wife have peace in her husband's house. All right? Allow my wife have peace in her husband's house. You can go back to your husband's house if you want to. But please, let my wife be. Else, you have me to contend with. Nonsense. Shoes away. Smell away. In Anuya, smell away. You are very foolish. If you had any atom of sense or brain inside that your empty skull, you will know that there is no way I will allow my father's lineage to close or end. I will not try it. So you better go and tell that a fool of your wife, that empty barrel, that witch, to produce a child from you. Oh, my Henry, let her, let her give birth to a child. If she doesn't do it, I will bundle her out of this compound with immediate alacrity. Then I will go outside there. I will find a fruitful lady. I will bring her into this compound. I will enforce her on you. You cannot do that. Hey, Goleku. You cannot do that. I will do it. You cannot do that. Hey. Let my wife enjoy her husband's household. I'm warning you now. husband. I am warning you now. Go and prove yourself a man. No, sir. If you me, go and prove yourself a man. Shake it. Prove yourself a man. That is the only thing you do. But when it comes to proving yourself a man, you put a flip. Give me a chance, or I will descend on both of you. Ah! Chero! This is not normal. A man has not been able to prove himself a man, yet he's not bothered. This one that he is busy is defending that flip. Then you need to go Is he still working at all? Corner or blank? Hey. Anyway, I don't care whose fault it is. The only thing I care is that you should, you should give me a child in this house. If you don't give me a child, that's even in it. I will keep bringing women inside. I will keep bringing women. Hana, they are an apple. One out to an apple. Until one, we give birth. Whether by hook or by crook. Nonsense! Try it! Try it! I went to my husband's and now So it cannot be for my language. Yes, it cannot be for my brother. It must be for my language. I could I could I could I command you to dry your tears. You are not a barren woman. What would you be? After all, you are left father, my brother, gave birth to children, which you are one of them. Why, 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 why would be a, a barren woman? Why? Uncle, if I am not barren, then what is delaying my conception? You know how I reserved myself. I married my husband as a virgin. Why is life? Why is life turning against me? I could have stopped speaking blasphemy. Life cannot turn against you. You see the difference between you that call yourself a believer and myself, a traditionalist. A little trial, just this little trial will make you to lose your faith entirely. Why? Uncle, I would be this worried if my husband's sister, Wakego, is giving me peace. She is giving me troubles. Troubles, troubles. <sighs> Listen to me. Do not allow anybody to rob your peace of mind away. Because children do not visit only last mind or womb. See one as a distraction and she doesn't deserve your tears. 
Did you get what I said? Uncle, I will try further. But if I see a way to run out of that house, I will not hesitate. Mm -mm. You won't do such. Hence, you are at peace with Ahamefina, my in-law. No, you won't. And don't try it. Huh? Why are you just crying as if you are hopeless? Don't you know that you have someone like Onadike standing behind you? Do you understand what I just said?
gallivanting and jumping around like a pregnant lizard. Ah! Don't worry. No, 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 sister, you're crying for her, I get the Akwenka. We in our mouth no kagonka. Obiaba, ne me gine bapa. See, sister, eh, I'm very, very upset with you, and I'm very, very angry with your husband. Why is it that your husband is still keeping this wicked and unreasonable woman here? Why? Why? What would you have a Hamifula do? What would you have the poor young man do? As it stands, his hands are tied. He has absolutely nothing to do because the entire family are in support of Mwake go stay in this house. Or would you prefer he chase her out like her husband did? Of course. Sister, let her go. Let her go back to her husband's house. See, sister, you need peace. You need your privacy. This is your husband's house. You need time and space to enjoy your marriage. Can't you see? Can't you see it? Peace. Do not forget that Sister Makego was instrumental to my marriage to her brother. The only problem she has with me is my childlessness. Mm, your childlessness. Has there been in any way Alpha Mifuna got you pregnant and you did not keep the child? Has it ever happened? No. Are you God that creates children? No. So why are you crying? See, sister, I don't want to unleash my anger on that woman. She will not like me. I'm just keeping myself because if I show her my true colors, she will know why they call me peace. Oh. She will know why they call me peace. Now stop crying. Why are you crying now now? Stop crying. We are stop crying. You will not understand. Peace, you will not understand. Stop crying. She doesn't deserve your tears. She doesn't. She can't be making you to cry, and you're here crying. The same water, the same flesh and blood. Malo Banoa, Oye Bob, I am Pocolo, Abatobi, and Welling upon to fighting will not solve this problem. Let's come together. As one family and live in peace. Wakego, yes, I'm one of them. Wakego, Wakene Kai Meriki. Wakego, Wakego, yes, I'm one of them. Wakego, I'm one of them. Meriki, Bahara. Wakego. That is not possible. There is no way I would ask my sister in law who just came to visit me to leave without telling her what she did. It's not possible. Hey, man, man. Why are you pretending like you don't know what she did? What did she do? Pia? Who gave her the courts? Who gave her that power, that audacity? Who gave her the authority to challenge me more in my own father's house? Onapuala! Onapuala! What impunity? Okay, go, you should understand that 
am the one who called the shot here. I am the man of this house. This is my father's house. I am my father's only son. I call the shots. If you want to show your power, you go to your husband's house and not here. Stop this nonsense you're doing. Ibu Fulefu. Ibu Fulefu. You are your own father's son. Act like a son. Imeme. But you know, I don't blame you. I don't blame you at all. Because you're the one who gave that your foolish wife and that her imbecile looking sister the guts, the wings to fly. But I don't worry. I will treat them very well. Meme follow. And he are not see your name. You are a fool. That's your business. If you're tired of this house, you can go back to your husband's house. Yes, go back to your husband's house so I'll have peace in this house. Yes. What's your problem? <laughs> Every day, fight, fight, fight. Every day, quarrel, quarrel, quarrel. I'm tired. I can see that you people want to undermine the office of the first daughter in this family. Me, look at me. If you're not happy, you people will give me the respect that I deserve. You people will know that I am the one in charge of this family. Kaikuria, don't say I did not tell you. Because Igana, you will stay here and see how I will handle that miscreant if she does not leave this compound. Kaikuria, what nonsense are you? Office of office, office of what? Office of first uh, what, 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 what are you saying? But no, again. No, can you not call it in here? The office yeah, of first place. Uh, Your mess when they marry, they also leave their father's compound. They go outside and build like a man. But I'm going with Flip. You are here struggling with your father's house. Who oh, no, oh, no, 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 Pour the water now. Johnny and eh? my love. Please to avoid troubles. Why don't my sister here go back to our father's house? For peace to reign. Pico. What did she say? Eh? Over my dead body, madam. Over my dead body. How can one kego blow the piper in a compound that I inherited from my late father? As the only son. She's mad. Peace is going nowhere. She will remain here. Let the heavens fall. Ona Puala. Okay. You know my sister. This one, she likes to cry. Please. Instead of me to cause her pain, let me just go back to my father's compound. At least we have a compound. Let me go back there. Peace. I still maintain my stand. You are going nowhere. You will be in this compound. Let the heavens fall. This is too much for one go now. This is too much for her. Can you please listen to my word of advice for words? I don't want my sister here to make headlines as the reason for your problem with your sister. Pico. Leave my hand. What, what, what is this one saying? Eh? Stay out of this, oh. Stay out of this. Are you not supposed to be the one fighting for your, for your rights in this house? Protecting your own possession. This is your own property, your husband's house. Why can't go? She'll go back to her husband's house. What nonsense are you saying? You're here telling me you, 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 for, for the sake of peace. You are going nowhere. You stay here. Thunder will fire her. What kind of nonsense? You know, that attack that was launched on you earlier wasn't for you. It was meant for me. She wanted to bring me out and finish me as usual. But no, 
I will disappoint her. I will not give her that opportunity. One name. Please. I want you to get yourself ready and leave this house. Pico. Huh. Hey. Hey. Hey, sister. You check it this thing check you. Did you check it? See. I hope if I leave, my in-law will not be angry with you. I would rather have her yeah. misunderstanding with my husband than contend with that witch in that house. I've never seen someone as wicked and heartless as my sister-in-law. Sister, no problem. I will go if that will make you happy. Because all I want is for you to be happy. And if that will make my in-law not to be upset with you, because I don't want you to be unhappy. I see, I am not afraid of I'm not afraid of that woman. I am not I am not afraid of her. I am not. Calm down. Huh? I know you care for me. I know you want the best for me. But don't worry, I will be fine. Thank you for your understanding. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you for fighting for your sister. <sighs> I believe if our parents were to be alive, all this wouldn't be happening. Uh -huh. So if they are not alive, they should kill us. No, because they are not alive, they should kill us. See, I am alive. Oh. My name is Peace. I will not be alive. And watch that woman torment you in your own husband's house, all in the name of marriage. Now give me, eh? See, you see that woman? I will not be alive and watch her do you any harm. It will, it will not happen. You I will make sure I protect you. You shouting, she might hear your voice. Nah, eh? Sister, give me a minute, give me It's very annoying. You never come here again, eh? 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 Come and uh, get your things so you go. go. Hey! Oh, you go. You go. Are you your camera? You we are one. The same water, the same flesh and blood. Maluba no wa onye po ba yam po kolo. Abwa tobi, ewe lo yabontu. Fighting will not serve. Now that I know that you are just an empty vessel making noise up and down, the full of idiots. You should seek for peace just once. You asked my sister to leave your father's house, not your husband's house. So why are you making noise? Why are you backing? Yeah, Akudo. It is that noise that will kill you with the thunder that will accompany it to your house. I don't know if you look at this one that is talking. Empty barrel. Eh? Bearing he goats. You have the mouth to talk. Respect your old age, Chineka You should respect your old age. Why can't go? See, you lack shame. If you let me boogie. You lack shame. See, look at the way they threw you out of your husband's house. So, I'm going gracefully. You came back to your father's house without your children, so, without husband. He <laughs> fell out there, Maggie, and you're here talking to my sister. Oh, you me. should have shame. I am not the first one, and I will not be the last. Okay, Mama. No, now. Why should I be ashamed? This one I'm doing is with my power. I have not started using my connection. In Anuya. So I'm making noise. Suze way. In fact, when you get to that your house, go to the grave of your miserable parents. And repeat this thing that you said. 
and no fear. All those your parents are all over. If for your great great grandfather, all over. He was married in a garden a street. I'm very sure you inherited it. Look at them, daughters of doom, daughters of iniquity, and daughters of unfruitfulness. That is what you are. You came here to rob your bad luck on us. Make way, mba, lose away, fool away. Is it not obvious? Eh? I got you, my baby. It's very obvious that you've been the one eating my sister's children in her womb, but she will not see. On the right hand, make a bread near here. Your sister's womb is empty. Oh, my father, yeah. No, I got to to be sure. Yeah, fool away. I don't blame you. Fool no, away. Every time I come back, you know that. Every time I come back, you know that. Who is now living? Every time I now walk, I thought we were doing challenge. Come now. So you are now living. Come on now. No joke. You are now living up here. No joke. You are now living. Fool away. Get away, shut up. If you don't know what to say. Don't you know that matters like this are crucial and very delicate? That it should be handled with care and maturity. I defend him now. No, no, keep go ahead and defend him. Men, you always defend each other. Eh? What is dear? What is difficult in wanting the sister to stay away from the wife? No, what is difficult to Get in on Najaka. In on Najaka. But uh, she's making the she's saying the right thing. Yes, and Sinkiru is making a point. Why can't why can't Alpha Mifuna talk to the to the sister to leave my sister the hell alone? Why is she trying to frustrate my sister's life? Why can't she go back to her husband's house? Hey, will you hey peace, will you shut up? You are talking to your uncle. Listen to me. Ahan will take his time. He has to be this is an issue. This issue is delicate. Look at Akudo, the wife. Wakego, the sister. He has to take his time and handle this maturely. As one we accuse him of taking sides. Yes. Don't you know that it's a delicate matter? Yes! Oh, how many fool I saw a man! A man is a man that will stand on his ground. Yes. Eh? Stop firm and call the spade a spade. Now go there and stand firm and call the spade a spade. Will you shut up? Uncle. Uncle. Auntie. Ha! You people should not say that I, peace, did not come to report to you people. If anything, if that girl touch my sister like if anything happens to my sister Kudo, i swear she will regret ever knowing me Tigress. i will destroy her Stop, Tigress. i will destroy her you cannot do anything you why don't you kill them before you start coming here look at you you are hitting hand on me okay now go there and fight them go there and fight them yourself hence you think that uh, Onadike is a fool. You are here hitting a young mad who told Kosh. No, you come, man. Now you're going to do. Why would they make a girl? Now, 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 Akudo! Akudo! 
On whose authority did you sleep this house? My friend, I asked you a question! My husband, I only want peace to reign. Of what use is this killing and dying, quarreling every day in this house? Of what use is it? I'm not finding it funny any longer. It's no longer funny. Are you indirectly calling me a weakling? Akudo? Are you indirectly telling me I do not know how to possess my possessions? That is not what I meant. I mean no harm. I know the man I married. I know you to be a very strong man. A man that keeps to his words. But if my sister's departure will make peace reign in this house, then let it be. Please, forgive me. Things have to stop following the same trend in this house. I am the man of the house. I will curtail Mwakigo's excesses. I will. And then what happens? People will see me as a problem between you and your only sister. Who cares about what people will say? Who cares? Listen, Mwakigo will either leave this house alive or... God forbid! Heaven bear me witness that I will not leave to witness any violence in this house. I will never witness it with my eyes. I'd rather run out of this marriage than witness that happen. I'd rather remain unmarried than all this problem every time. That's all right. We'll see about this. We'll see about this. I'm only asking for peace. It's just peace that I want. I don't know why everyone in this house don't want peace. Everybody wants to kill. Everybody wants to die. Everybody wants war. You people should welcome peace in this house. What kind of thing is this? It's just peace that I want. Am I asking for too much? I just want peace. It's just peace that I want. <laughs> Wakego, one United we stand, but divided we follow. And to Wakego, there is something I want to discuss with you. And to Mark Ego, I said I want to discuss with you. Ezo, you want to discuss with me? Ekudo Chebia, and you came with a seat. You don't have respect at all. Oh, full pro respect. You shot Azu Ogazu. Oh, you want to discuss with me, and you came with a chair so that we will discuss as what? As colleagues, Obia? Or as friends? Or as mates? Which one? None of the above. Ezo, but as your brother's wife. Hmm. By the way, as the woman you found suitable for him and recommended her to him for the wife. <laughs> that was then. But now I know I made a big mistake because I thought you were who you were pretending to be. There is no pretense in my life. Not even a single one. I am as transparent as water. I am who I am both in and out. Anyway, what I want to discuss with you is that you should please try and make peace with your brother. Akudo, you are a useless pretender. You will flip. A useless pretender. Anyway, I don't have a brother. So you and that's your so-called husband, eh? You are on your own. Don't disturb me again. Get out of my sight. Zoos away, come for us. Come for the chinaka for a care. It is better for me to see a wall gecko now, more lizard, than seeing you. Pella can never be anya. Auntie Akudo, don't be surprised that you will wake up one day in this house and not see me. This place is becoming too hot for comfort. 
Ebe kitchen in Eje. Where do you think you're going? You're not going anywhere. Now that your friends are beginning to find you out, you want to run away. Ha ha ha! nka abu kwa peri peri, peri peri nke wu ife no kwa ni hu. Akwa be kwa binsa akwa moya moya wenes. You want to run away? Mbanon. My problem has just started though. Onye bo somewhere. Look at you. I told you since to go, you did not go. It is now that I'm ready for you. That I have packaged your trouble for you. You want to run away. So that you will enjoy the trouble. Mbanono. You will stay here and enjoy that problem with me till the end. Onye bo so. Mwe. Akudo. Do you ever realize that you have an uncle like Onadike? Look at you, suffering verbal, emotional and psychological trauma in the name of one senseless woman. And you have foolishly decided to keep quiet until you die. Okay, look at it. Why? I could why? <laughs> Uncle. Uncle, you are old in this marriage institution. And you know that marriage is not a bed of roses. Yeah? It's not like bread and butter. So marriage do have their own challenges. And I, I am accepting my own challenge in good faith. Akuro, have you ever eaten bread in this house? Since you married Aham, have you eaten bread? It has all been boom, 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 boom. Look, look, look at it. You are looking around to see if... The... Akuro, what's your problem? Akuro, what's your problem? What challenge are you talking about? You prefer to die for a particular problem you did not create. A particular problem you are not, that is not of your fault. Why do you decide to keep quiet until you die? I'm sorry. I'm sorry for not reporting my family problems I... to you. The thing is that I thought it would be of disturbance to you. You're already doing too much for my sister and I. Since our, our parents died. Akudo, I can see that you are gradually losing it. Area leggy. Ahama and the sister have eaten you. Akudo, listen to me. What do you think my late brother will be saying in his grave that I abandoned you? I will not! Uncle, calm down. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, 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 I'm sorry for keeping you in communicado. Akudo, Uncle. the bright price Ahama Fla paid on your behalf. I have it here. Do you want me to bring it out? I, hope, I could listen to me. If the, our family gate is wide open, if you try everything you can to make your marriage with her and work, with her sources, I could have come back home. I could have, I said, come back home. I could have, I, 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 I could You have changed overnight, my beloved sister. What is the problem? Uh, sister, what you do? Like I mentioned earlier, you see, I'll need some money. Enough money so I can go back to the city and re-establish myself, you know, get back online. Because sitting down here in this village and rusting is not going to do this family any good. Though. It's better I go back, you know. Ah, see, as I'm, the way I'm seeing, uh, uh, as I'm just looking at you now, eh, I am seeing a very big inflation. Uh, I am seeing a fool that doesn't have sense. You know, I thought you had sense, oh. I thought you, you are reasonable. But now, as I'm looking at you, you have just dawned on me that of oh, bro, shaking the sense you don't have. In fact, eh, the way I'm looking at you, if you ever, this you're here, this your upstairs, it's empty. Oh, you know, it's ready, yeah? sister, why, 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 why would you say a thing like this now? Why, why would you say this kind of thing? Is it because I'm asking you for financial help? Why would you say this now? I am not parting with any of my shishin. Many also. Koba Afo, you will not see. I have tried. I have tried. Look at you. Eh, this thing that I'm staying here is not doing the family any good. It's not doing you any good. It doesn't concern the family. I'm going to come. Ah, look at your, 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 your sense of entitlement. See, you have in laws. You have in laws. Go and ask them for financial help. They should help their daughter's husband. That is 
is what they are supposed to do. No, no, I'm going back to change me, boom. Sister, what can you go? Sister, what can you go? Sister, what can you go? In a shout, what happened? Wait, don't think because I'm asking you for money, I don't know what I can do. Eh? Don't think I'm confused, though. I know my rights in this house. It's you. Don't make me wake up one day and go into order for our father's property, sell it off, raise enough capital for myself, and, and, and go back to the city. Please. Don't try me, oh. Please, again, what did you just say? Hey, hey, I'm Maya. I'm trying it. Try it. See, any day you wake up and you decide to go inside your spirit and you agree with your spirit that you have lived enough, that you don't want to live on this earth again, nature, and you want to die, or you wake up and look around and now decide. And the fresh air that you are enjoying, you don't like it anymore. Or this freedom that you are enjoying, you don't like it anymore. Eh? Eh? Go and touch any of my father's land. Ah, you will not in prison. Tell sister that you, you, you cannot do anything. What do you mean? You arrest, you, 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 you send me to prison for selling of my own father's property. You cannot do it, Joe. Ah, you cannot do it. It's him, Stop oppressing me. You I cannot, cannot do it. it. <laughs> See, maybe traditionally, eh, you can walk into the land, Neraria for Anya, look at the land and all that. But Afam, you will not do it until you give me my money. Yes, Afam, you will give me the money I spent on our father when he was sick. Oh, Buaria, you did not bring Shishi. You will also give me the money I spent on his burial. After all, Lord your father but I did it. Where were you? Oh. Yes, so maybe when you do all that, eh, eh, you can go and die inside that land if you like. I don't care. Now I understand. Mm. Now I understand that you are not even alright upstairs. Again. Your, your head is not even working very well. But I will show you that I am the only son of this family. Just watch. Look, let him. Just watch. Watch, 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 Maya. Watch. I watch what will happen. Maya. I will prove to you that Please. I am the only son of this family. What do you mean? I will not Oh God, you cannot oppress me. You cannot oppress me. I will not be oppressed. Okay. You are not be oppressed. You are not to be Your mouth will be ranting. When I say that you are talking to you, you, you will not know how empty you are. Maya, if you touch any piece of land, eh? In what? Nonsense. Thank God I went there and I interviewed Akudo. Why would she be dying in silence as if she has nobody? If we were young, wag. Huh? Did you see it? Did you not pick offense when I urged you to go and talk things over with Afam? Just imagine, it. imagine my own is eating the bread of sorrow. Huh? Huh? See, may the gods of the land vindicate me. I have decided to take the bull by the horn. Wham. Huh? Wham. Your stand is ideal. Good. Huh? Because that for Akudo, she will be trying dying to to work, make this work. I say I shouted at her. Why would you foolishly want to make a worrisome marriage work by fire by thunder? I asked her whether she's smart or stupid. Hmm. Eh? Hi. And soon people will be talking, hmm? accusing you of negligence that you abandon her to her fate because she's not your direct daughter. Nkiro, my wife, are you just gazing? Who knows if that they've not started discussing and gossiping already? See, that victimization must stop. It must. It should stop. Because even the spirit of your late brother is running around. Eh? To see your action. Even now, I think he's here watching. But I have to do that. Nons Hi. Nonsense. Uncle, I don't understand. How can one cable stand against me? Because I decided to sell off my father's property, my late father's property, in order to get established. Why? Ah. My cousin, Bikon, hmm? mellow down. Jiwai. Hmm? You see, this issue can be handled peacefully with maturity and understanding. No, 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 oh, because yes. I, I'm not understanding anything here, Uncle. I'm not getting it. Ordinary Wakego, a girl, a woman, stopping me from exercising my rights as the only son of this family. No, 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 no. It's not possible now. It's not possible. Aham. Uh -huh. You see, Wakego. It's not ordinary in this traditional matter. Oh yes. As I've rightly told you, we need to resolve this issue amicably for peace to reign. So what you're saying, in essence, is I need her consent. 
Eh, uncle? Listen, I am going to exercise my right as the only son. And as a matter of fact, I will pour liberation on our late father's grave against Wakego for standing against me. Ah, Mefula! Don't you ever think of trying what you've just said. Because if you do, the spirit of your late father and our ancestor will kill you immediately without no apology. That's you got a go? That's a lie, uncle. Why eh? would my father kill me? Why would my late father kill me? Why would my ancestors kill me? Am I not the true son of my father? Of course, you are the true son of a lion. But you see, we need some certain rights and obligations to conduct before you can have such rights. Ah, Mefula. I know what I'm saying. Why do I sense blackmail here? No, because I perceive blackmail. It's obvious. It's obvious. I'm Mua Ufomadu, a title holder. Blackmail you my cousin, my own blood? What would I gain from doing such things? I'm Ogini ne meba. Very nonsense people. No, 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 no. I, I, I was not even expecting this from my own. Yes. Because I am very sure that Mwakeko must have been fed in with lots of bread. So he's at liberty to, 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 to vomit rubbish from his mouth. My husband, I have warned you severally to calm down. You should be very careful about this, your hot temper. Do you know that if you had calmed down, you would have known the reason why you cannot exercise your sonship? Listen, I don't care about this corrupt declaration. Yes, very soon I will bring shame to his face and that of watching him. I will show to them who is more qualified in this family. I will prove it to them, I promise you. Huh? What we are talking of here is about tradition and custom. And when it comes to tradition and custom, you have to be very careful because it can be a two-edged sword. The dead can sometimes be unreasonable. I don't have time for this, your advice. Or. I don't have time for this, your, 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 your advice is now. I don't have the time. Meanwhile, remind me, there's something I would like you to do for me. I am still your wife. That peaceful and loving Akudo that you married. I'm not going to be old. 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 What just happened now? is really a sweet taboo. Do you know why? That shows that our ancestors are alive and they are active. Why is Yoku Nadiki? They are more alive than we the mortals. You got to go? That is true. That is true. Ah. They are immortals. They do not die. But we human beings, we are mortals and we die. Yeah? Our ancestors, Atam Dilelu. <laughs> Nadiki, uh -huh. if I may ask, why the comparison? Uh, you see that actually I was going to your house before I see you on the road. And the reason I want to see you is very important and genuine. It is of crucial importance that we should have to iron it out and now. Nadiki, hmm? that could be good omen and the wishes of our ancestors. Now tell me, Nadiki, what is the problem? Okay, for? It's about my niece, Akudo, whose hand I gave in marriage to Amifuna. Your cousin Wakego does not want that girl to enjoy her marriage. Nadike, Ogini ne meba. Nadike, Ogini ne meba. Why is it that no one has brought this to my knowledge? And if I may ask, Nadike, why is she dying and what is the problem? Ogin Listen to me. Eh? Do you see that Wakego? That divorcee. She's not giving my niece any rest. And the my niece Akudo is dying slowly every day. Why? Hey, hey, huh? hey. Nadiki, Bikun, Bikun, I 
promise you that I will settle these issues amicably between them. Biko. I hope you bought a sizable one. Um, you did not tell me the purpose, but I bought a good one and a bottle of snacks. Go and bring it, let me see. That won't be a problem. Tomorrow, I want to confirm the legitimacy of my sonship in this family. You want to go fetish? No. I want to go traditional. I want to pour libation on my late father's grave to find out between Wakego and I who is more superior in this house. Hey, Papa, are you sure you are doing the right thing? Of course. Won't this amount to voodooism? Eh? My love. If I don't do this, I will remain a slave in my father's house. It's not possible now. I won't let that happen. Please go and keep these things. Tomorrow I ask you for them. I'm not okay with this thing. Go inside and get me those cups. Good morning. This one you are holding in a night. Just go inside. Get me those cups. It's time. Hurry up. My love, do you still want to go ahead with this? Yeah? Hope you made the inquiries. You know this practice is spiritual. Akudo, what is wrong with you? My friend, go inside and get me these cups, yo. Get me the cola nut, the schnapp, and the, the, the that power. Hurry up. We are one. The same water, the same flesh and the blood. Malukwanu, what kind of play is this now? It's not play, no. It's not just the snap. The cock is dead. Akudo, who, who killed this cock you bought yesterday now? I should be asking you. No, I don't understand. Who killed this cock? Something happened in the house today. Will I say a mystery happened there? Uh, wait, 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 Amifula. What could that be? I hope no one is dead. No, Uncle, nobody died. Uncle, yesterday I sent my wife to the market to buy me a cork, a bottle of schnapp and cola nuts, so that today I can pour libation on my late father's grave. Eh? This morning I was ready to perform the rituals, and then I asked my wife to bring out everything. To my greatest surprise, Uncle, the cock was dead. The schnapp was empty. The, the, the schnapp bottle, it was empty and still corked though. The cola nut was nowhere to be found. Eh? I, 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 I don't understand what happened there. I don't understand. Eh? Ah, me fula! Uncle, 
I, I need to know, I need to know if, if, if my father is angry at me or if I was stupid to her, try to, to, to pour libation on my father's, uh, uh, late father's grave. Eh? Ah, me fula! Uncle? You don't mean it! Uncle, I mean it. I'm, I'm, I'm serious, so. This is what happened in the house. Eh? Ah, me fula! Uncle? Ah, me fula! The spirit of our ancestor. The spirit of my late brother, Ayao. Please vindicate me. I have no agreement with Ahame Fula. However, kindly forgive him for his stupid act. Biko, Biko. Ah, me fula. Yeah. Take cola nut, please. No, no, I don't. I don't like cola nut. What can you do? Please, don't like cola nut. I could do. Ah, me fula. Uncle. What do you know about tradition? I don't know anything about tradition. Yeah? When did I start that, uh, studying tradition? I don't know anything about tradition. I don't want to know. Ah, me fula. Uncle. Your elder sister here, Mwake Go. Is she aware about your intention? to pour libation or sacrifice on your late father's grave? No, she's not aware. Eh? Wait, Kangota Godi, because I'm lost here. What sacrifice are you talking about? Uh, Adanaya, please, just do the listening here. You know I called for this meeting and I promised to clear your confusion here. Hmm. Just watch. If you say so. <laughs> ah, me fula. Uncle. From the time that your late father was sick in the hospital till his death and burial, how much did you contribute? Uncle, this one, you're asking me this kind of question. You are aware I was in Kenya then, now serving my master. I was far away. Yes, it was Mwakego here and her husband that showed her the whole expenses now, which is what they're supposed to do. We're one family. But so never have it. Now, let me ask you Did you ascertain how much was spent and try to refund from the expenses? Did you? No, I don't understand, Uncle. This kind of question you're asking me refund how? Did I take any loan from the bank? It is a family affair now. Stop 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 this thing you're doing, Abed. Stop it. Let me say my mind. Hey! If you said I should shut up, I would have told him to take my life. Just say I want to. That's quite too much. I'm not sure ever. You're not poor. No, go tell us. You're talking to me. I don't understand. Leave me alone. Let me let me say my mind. What's all this? You have long mouth. I'm a fool. Am I supposed to refund money that I used to bury your father? Shut up there! Shame on you. I must see that. Make sure never you have reform money, money you used to bury your own father. Are you not like some money you used to shut up your own father? Uncle, no, let me talk, let me talk. She's here, let me tell her. Tell her my Enough, father. Father. You did not contribute, but you want to chop from the proceeds. Are you, are you not a greedy goat? It is going. my father. I did not bring myself to this goal. What do you mean of that now? Refund what? Listen to me, ah, me fula. Uncle, in short, even when I sell properties, I will not even refund it. I will not give you any money. What is this nonsense now? Am I the one that said that you could do the better? Shut up there! All the kids are easy road. You can't just see road up here. You are still talking about selling property. The phone on the phone. The phone on the phone. The flavor. I'm a fuller. You are looking for what to sell. It is very lucky. Yes. You are very, very lucky. If you had lifted Colonel to the spirit of our ancestors or your late father, you would have been dead by now. I'm a fuller. Oh, yes. What? You would have been dead by now if you 
you have tried any libation. Thank God. Uncle. Uh -huh. What? What did I do to her? What wrong? What did I commit? Why is he so angry that he even went as far as trying to invoke the spirit of our late father on me? Get the camera. What did I do? Uh, okay, go. Be good. Hey! Please, hmm? Just calm down. Hmm. You see, the spirit of your late father and the ancestors of our family have vindicated you. Oh, yes. The item in question either got missing or died. So, cheer up. Okay, go. Be good. Uncle, did I not give Ahamifla three million naira? Three million. Hey, oh, three million. To put in his business. To support what his ogre settled him with. Did I not marry a wife for him? Did I not marry a kudo for him? What have I not done for that useless boy? Bamu, Bamu, what have I not done for him? Mwakego, I know. You have a good heart. See, I'm begging you. Unless you want to blame the gods for keeping me alive as your only surviving uncle that always stand for the truth. Oh yes. See, work ago. I want you to reward Ahame Fula's wickedness with kindness. Yes. Because I will not do it. You see that boy? I will not give him a dime again in this life. Instead of me to give him. Uncle, I will run oh, until I see a big river. Biko. I will dive inside and drown. Biko. Instead of me to give him shishi Biko. again. Biko. That boy is useless. Hey. He is greedy. Entitlement mentality will kill him. Biko. Very hostile, useless boy. Biko. That is what he is. Biko. I know you've tried. You have a good heart. Biko. Hey, Biko. Biko. That boy, Biko. Biko. If it's the last thing you do, that Biko. boy, Biko. Biko. Forgive him, please. Be cool. Sure. Eh? No, I, I don't understand now. What do you want me to say? I believe by now you can see what your persistent refusal to listen to my advice would have cost you. Hi. Why is everyone against me in this house? Why is everyone against me in this family? Was I not pushed to the wall? Or do you want me to suffer and suffer until I die? Why will you suffer and suffer until you die? No, tell me. Why will you suffer and suffer until you die? Your destiny sits in any man's hands. Is it? Let me ask you one question. Had it been your late father left no landed properties, wouldn't you have survived? Wouldn't you have lived? I warned you. Remember, Agualongiagwa. Well, I, I don't understand the meaning of what you're saying. You're, you're not even moving in accordance with what I'm saying. I don't get it. Are you trying to tell me that uh, uh, Wakego has more rights than me in this family? Afam, can, can you please stop being logical about this? Stop applying logic. What is your problem? Your uncle was vocal about it. Yes, he was vocal when he said that inheriting the late properties comes with responsibilities and liability. You should go and ask for your sister's mercy to be able to dispose some of the lands and help yourself. I, 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 I ask for my sister's mercy. Ask for my sister's mercy. Here, yeah, ask for my sister's mercy. Why am I even the first son of this family? The first and only son of this family. What are you saying, self? What are you even saying? You think the gods are not wise? You know what? I am tired of giving you any advice. I am tired of bringing my suggestions because it's obvious you do what you want. You should go and bury your father by repaying your sister, your elder sister, every time she spent in treating and burying your father. Afterwards, you can talk about inheritance. That is the tradition. Thank you. Oh, so it, 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 has, it has gotten to you walking out on me, eh? 
Wait. Ah, Mefula, you are very lucky. And you see, I have to be frank with you. You touched the tiger by the tail, and you're lucky that it didn't consume you. So I advise you now, go and apologize to Nwaka Ego. Yes. No, Uncle, I don't get it, too. Apology up and down. You're talking of apology here, apology there. Are you telling me if I do not apologize to Mark Ego, I cannot go in and claim my father's estate? Ah, Mefula, a man destined to drown must surely drown, even in a spoon of water. Oh, yes. The stubborn flies follows the corpse into the grave. Try this, Ah, Mefula. Try it as a man. Uncle, I'm not, get, I'm, not, I'm not getting this, you know. Eh? This whole thing is scattering my head. I don't get it. Are you telling me that Mwakego has more rights than me in this family? Is this what you're trying to say? Ah, Mefula! Until you are able to offset all the expenses incurred during your father's sickness and burial, my answer is yes. Oh, yes. It's all right. Inuko? It's all right, Uncle. Thank you very much for coming. Thank the you. truth is always better, but must be told. No, I said it's all right. It's all right. I've heard you. Ah, peace. Mm. Why can't you just upgrade my request and move in with me? You are only here. What is happening here? Ah. How can you even say that, Vita? Do you hear yourself? Each time you say this thing, I've been trying to just keep quiet about it. Because I don't know why you will go ahead and be telling me to move in with you when you've not even done anything on my head. If you know you love me the way you claim you do, and everything you've been saying to me, come and see my uncle. Come and see my uncle and do the right thing. Do you ha. know that indirectly you are trying to push me to some willy ladies aside there with all this you are saying? Eh, hey, no problem. If that is your choice, no problem. Go and meet them. I, peace, I will never do the wrong thing. I will never carry myself and move in with a man that has not paid anything on my head or done church wedding or anything. I will never do it. Man, me, eh, me. Ah, huh. Let me tell you something. Just understand the anger I'm coming from. Lovers can elope themselves without observing this traditional protocol you are saying. Yes! I will never do that, Peter. If that is what you want, that I should move in with you, get pregnant and start living with you, yeah, I will never do it. I will never do it. I will not be that girl that will just go with a man and be living with them. I will not get my uncle's blessings. I will not get my auntie's blessings. I will not get my sister's blessings. My in-law, everybody. I will never do it. Ah, uh, Peter. Yeah. Just come uh -huh. yeah. I'm not saying that you are not going to receive their blessings. You hear me? You just matter of maybe let's say one more thing. Oh, uh, Peter! Peter! N-O. No. Why you be so hard? If you want those girls, no problem. Go and meet them. Peter, stop complaining. Eh? Why are you afraid of getting the traditional right done? Eh? If truly you love peace. Why? Ah, uh, uh, Joyce, it's like you are misunderstanding me here. It is high time that you know that when they say love is blind, has gone far away. You hear me? It's just a simple request. She get pregnant, then I will pay the traditional right. Do you hear me? But no pregnancy, no marriage. It's as simple as ABC. Does it mean that you are doubtful of her fruitfulness? I didn't say so. It's just a simple policy. If she get pregnant, I will perform the formalities. It's as simple as ABC, like what I said earlier. Yeah. Hi, Peter. Peter, you don't reason like a progressive man. How do you mean? Other men out there do not reason or think the way you are. How do you mean? Yes. See, let me tell you, I am Peter DK. I do my things the way it pleases me. And one thing you must understand, and before I commit myself to anything, I must got the result of my pursuits. You hear me? So either she align with my request or stay rejected. It's as simple as that. Uh, 
How can we continue like this? Is this how we're supposed to raise enough money to get established again? You have to stop complaining. You know you can't do anything about this condition. The only thing you should do is keep believing in God. Very soon, we will come back. Hmm? You know you're actually a gift from God to me. You are a blessing to me. I'm not. I'm not. How can I be a blessing to you when I can't even provide for you? How can I be a blessing to you when this is what I subject my wife to all in the name of marriage? You seem to forget things very soon. Have you forgotten? Dear, we are days when money was not our problem. Our money did not last now. The money did not last. All of it down the drain just like that. It did not last. Aham. The downfall of a man is not the end of his life. Do you know the worst thing that will happen to you? It is losing hope. You don't have to lose hope. Keep your hope alive. Now you're not just my wife, but also my mother. In one package. Babe, stop. Let's go back I to believe work. you're here to redesign me and also repackage me. Of course. That as is well. why I'm here. So let's go back to work. Hmm? Oh, go, go. Don't be a lazy man. Go. from Peter's mouth. Can you imagine Peter telling me I should move in with him before he will come and pay my bride price? That means he sees me as a low budget girl now. I don't have class. Is it not? My dear peace, <laughs> if I tell you that I was not shocked to my bum man, seeing Peter called me a lie. I never expected that from him. Mm. Truly, this guy is in love. Never. <laughs> he never loved me. Because love I know, love doesn't, you know, love doesn't require you to, to prove a point. No, you do the right things for someone you love. <clears throat> not giving somebody condition of what to do. That is not love. Love is giving. Love is sacrifice. Love is a lot. What has he done for me? Nothing. <clears throat> he doesn't love me. It's obvious. Oh. It's very obvious. Babe, I was, just I was a... thinking aloud. <laughs> I was just a fool thinking aloud. What were you thinking? Peace on the second thoughts. Seeing Peter's pronouncement as a declaration of a man in love. So you call that thing a man in love? So this is how they've been fooling you? Oh, so they've been eating you all this while? They will tell you in Japan. They will tell you you go and open. Everywhere they will be eating you. So you can accept that thing that Peter said. Oh, Joyce. Hey, no! Hey, don't tell me, eh! Hey. No problem. Sure, you like him. You like him, Abby? No, Wahala. Go and meet Peter. Go and meet him. He'll be giving you more money to fix that all the long, long lashes. Because I can see you like wearing eyelashes. 
He will give you money. You go and put the long lashes, do the long nails and everything. Michael Riyadima. Go and follow him now. Who is begging you? See, a man that does not love won't want a lady to get pregnant. For That's him. a lie. That's a lie from pit of hell. Whoever that is telling you that is lying to you. Because any man that did not pay your bride price, did not do the right thing, how do you expect that marriage to prosper? If not that you're my friend there, eh, I would have walked you out of this my house. Yeah, Francis. Francis, make sure you get frail today. Oh. Make sure you get frail today, Chineka Ogoko. A fool, a fool, that is what you are. Deal with you. Ah! All my filling stations, no fuel. And you are here talking nonsense. You see, get it? Hey, what time you miss? Out of a woke, out of a woke, oh, moon again to walk in a meeting. You are a fool. Go uh, anyway, what am I even stressing myself? First is you are doing your own now. No, continue. I'm understanding, okay? I should understand. No problem. Share, I will pay you. I see all your hands. We be we are understand too. In a way. Are you still there talking? Come on, go for my phone and go and get food and say something. Always giving useless excuses. Mr. Well done. I show him that well done. Hold it there. Because anytime you say well done, I know what it means. Please, I don't need complete. Help me, Mark. I just need me alone. Sister, I'm sorry for disturbing you. I need just three minutes of your time. Let's let's tell I need to tell you something. Yeah. Do you know the meaning of self-respect? That is not the empire of Do you know what it is? Obviously you don't. Because open the way for me, if you know what it is, you will apply it now. Pico, respect yourself and leave me alone. Now that I'm saying quiet, you keep on you are yeah. Respect yourself. Respect yourself. This matter is very serious, and you need urgent attention. Please, just, just listen to me now. And I force my force. Are you forcing me? Chelo, you want to use your authority as the only son to force me to listen to you? Sister, I'm not forcing you to listen to me. Oh. Oh. Yes, I'm just saying you give me a listening ear at least to hear me out and know what I'm talking about. Thank God in your Iberi Ibe. And your stupidity, you still know that I have that freedom to decide whether I want to listen to you or not. With that freedom, I still maintain that I do not want to listen to you. Period. Okay. Now, wow. What kind of thing is this now? Every time, fight, 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 fight. Sister, come on. Hey, please. You, you, you need to take this hot thing now that is very hot. Very, very hot. It will be good for your stomach. Please. My room is on fire. I don't think I can take anything now. Are you serious? Don't worry. Your husband has gone to buy some medicine for you. He will soon be back. You know, go. Please. One month. I'm not sure I can survive this. What are you saying? I lost so much blood. I lost so much blood. Sister, don't ever lose hope. You see this God that we serve, He will never be alive and watch anything happen to you. I don't want you to be saying negative things. It is very bad. Nothing will happen to you. I'm all me and God, this and I don't even know how to describe it. Should I say miscarriage or what? Right there in the farm. The bleeding started uncontrollably. 
before Balasim now up. Thank God I went to Taham. If not, by now, you will be sitting with my corpse. God forbid. Chupa Mangwe. God forbid. Sister, you know what? I'm going to help you sit down so that you can drink and then you'll feel better before your husband gets here. Oh? Oh, yeah. Don't sit up with it. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry. Ah, okay. Sister? Ah, oh, Can you say me again? Ah, don't, don't. It's like fire is burning in my womb. Fire? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm dying. Go for me. Ah, Jesus! Sister! Sister! Sister, but tell me you're joking. Sister! Of blood. Eh? The chemist is requesting for two more. Eh? I don't know what to do in here. Why? I don't know, I'm tired. Ah, Mifula, why can't you take her to the hospital? Uncle, why are you talking like this now? Are you not part of this family? Don't you know what's going on? There's no money on ground now. Hey! What am I supposed to how, to, how am I supposed to pay the bills with my, 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 my boss? Hey, ah, Mifula. You see what your useless malice you've been keeping with your sister has caused you? Do you see that? Instead of you to humbly respect your sister and you will never suffer. But your pride will not allow you. Uncle, stop saying these things you're saying now. Stop saying these things you're saying. Why are you talking like this? I don't understand. Must I always worship Wakego because of money? Don't forget I'm a man, no. You shut up, Mechua Neba! Ah, Mefula, don't you know that a man without money is as good as dead? Don't you know that? So, eh? Now listen to me. God will not forgive you if anything should happen to Akudo because of your pride and carelessness. Ah, Mefula. I said I'm sorry now. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. Anyway, uh, Ah, Mefula, give me five minutes hmm? and come in. Wakego, <laughs> you see, you are a lady with a large heart. I mean, recounting on the way you treated all the member of this family. I said thank you. May God bless you. Amen. But Uncle, you don't need to thank me. Uh -uh. Looking at how things are, you know, it is only fair that we should be there for each other. You understand? Because we do not know why we were all brought together to become one family. So I will always help as much as I can and in any way that I can. Thank you so much. I've been very happy to hear this. You see, Wakego, your response to what we are discussing here tonight is the reason why I'm here to see you. And uh, you see, your younger brother, Ahame Fula, needs your help. Please. The mm. wife is dying in the chemist shop. Huh? Chemist shop? Yes. Please. That serves him right. Mm. Yes. Let him enjoy what he brought on himself. After all, he said he's the only son. 
the hair. And he has every right to throw me out of my own father's house. Maybe it is my father that is flogging him. So let him enjoy it. Maybe it is the punishment for running his mouth and disrespecting the person that has always helped him. Let him get out, please. It is his... Onyewa. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Uncle. Please. Uncle, please help me beg her now. Help me beg her. I'm sorry. Ah, Uncle, sell this a flame food. To leave my hand now. Let him leave my hand though. Because if I can't it, and he is still holding this hand, I will treat him like a thief. I will deal with him eh, until he regrets being born into this family. Aham. Aham. Come on, come Oh, sister, sister, kill me, kill me. Sister, sister, kill me. I have to roll. I'm dead already. Just kill me. Kill me. Look what? Yeah, I have to roll. I'm dead already. So what are you saying? Please, just kill me. Yeah. Old man, how did you walk into this place? And what is the meaning of this nonsense? The meaning is that I am hungry and need to eat. You are hungry and you need to eat. That is why you walked majestically in here and took what doesn't belong to you without even asking me. I decide on what to do, how to do it, and when to do it. Hey, 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 my friend. That rule can only apply to things that belong to you, not to other people's items. Woman, will you shut up your mouth? Then why you speak to me that manner again? I will if speak mad. to you. I will speak to you anyhow I want. What do you mean by that? You walk in here, pick something that doesn't belong to you, and you want to intimidate me on top of it. It's like you are very mad. I'll do things worse than that. If it, there's nothing you can do about it. Mok in and what? Try. Hey! 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 Biaba! Come back here. Come back here. She's a cat for Where do you think you're going with my phone? You're going to walk in and put that knife. You saw the knife. What do you do? Give me that knife. Give me that knife. You called my name. Do you know me? Who, who are you? What do you do? You are playing princess, enjoying and intimidating, leaving our farm and his family suffer. Am I right? No, he cost it. I used to help them until, until he... Shut up! Or I'll slash you into bits. Yes, sir. You must, from this moment, take care of our farm's family as the first daughter or else. Yes, sir. Open your eyes. I will chop off one of your ears so that any time you deviate, you will touch your ears and remember. Get 
Now, I was just thinking to myself, if men were good, ha <laughs> ha, everybody would be dead. Mm, if they have that kind of power, everybody would die. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I hope I'm not dreaming. I can't believe you're the one talking so nicely to me. <laughs> <laughs> I am the one. You know, I have been thinking to myself and imagining who are we to decide for God? Who are we to dictate to God? Who? No mortal can do that. Uh -huh. Because all power belongs to God. Exactly. All power belongs to God. Including the power of conception. Including the power to give children. It is solely in God's hands. So, I feel so bad for the way I treated you because you couldn't be a child for my brother. And I am really sorry about it. Hmm? But I now know, and I know it was wrong. Hmm? I to thank you. Thank you so much. I God. I can't believe this is happening. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. I love you so much. I, I love, love you more. I love you because if I didn't love you, I would not have recommended you to my brother. There's no way I would recommend a woman that I don't trust to my brother. That's my only brother. I look out for him all the time. Hmm? So don't worry. Everything is now okay. Hmm? Go. Thank okay. you. It's okay. May God bless you with peace <laughs> and joy. Thank you. Amen. Amen. I am so happy. I'm so at peace. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> I don't understand this excitement. What's going on? You will not understand. What's going on? You know, this news that I'm about to break. I am supposed to wait for you to eat first. But because of how excited I am, I cannot wait. <laughs> right. Oh God. Give me the good news. <laughs> say please. <laughs> please. Baby, say please. Please. Call me mommy. I beg. Call me mommy. Mom. <laughs> what okay. Is it? Let me tell you. Uh -huh. Can you believe that Auntie Mwakego asked for my forgiveness today? She did that? <laughs> yes. She pleaded with me and asked me to forgive and forget the past. In fact, we ate together. <laughs> Wow. I'm telling you. Are, are you serious about this? Honestly, I am very serious. You know, at a point, it was like a dream to me. But fortunately, it is reality. Wow. <laughs> God, I'm so happy. That's good to know. That's, that's good to know. <laughs> yeah, that's good to know. Now I see why you're excited. Yeah, mm -hmm. I should be. It's all right. Please go inside and get me my food. I'm hungry. Huh? And Simwa Kego and I have eaten your own portion of food. No, 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 no. That no is food for you. That is what I will not eat. <laughs> Please one them. Hey. I know they say change is constant, but it is still unbelievable to me. Hey, Chineke. Hey, hey. Sister Wakiga has changed. <laughs> hey, sister. Eh? It is shown very big. Sister, it is going very I'm telling you the truth, though. It's the way you. Sister Wakiga, where Sister Wakiga? Where Sister Wakiga has changed? Biko, go ahead, go ahead, Zabiko. What are you saying? Like, how do I make you understand this? You need to see how she was talking. She spoke so convincingly that my husband and I have no single doubt in our mind. We believe her. And we've also seen that she has changed. I'm very sure it's one of her tricks. She's tricking you and your husband and you're here. Opening your mouth. 
She's tricking you and your husband. No way. It's no tricks at all. See, do you know that she confessed and regrets all her past deeds? She is even blaming herself for ending her marriage instead of going to the Lord in prayer. You know, some Guinea? <laughs> you mean Wakego is regretting everything? I'm telling you. Hey, why would she regret? Yes, she's supposed to regret all the Vugu Vugu, Oneko, Lokozona, Amanda Naya, Omoa, Bulldozer Jesus. <laughs> no, let her be rising. I come call her Eko, Oneko. <laughs> Obria, see, all these things you're saying, me, I don't believe anything that that woman has changed. I will never believe her. <laughs> you just spoke as if you were present there at the meeting. Sawa Kego has promised to be a changed person. She has promised to be obedient, loyal, accommodating, and lovable. Hey, hey God, I'm so happy! Oh, sister. <laughs> oh, Akudo. Oh, you may give your man the anama. Look at you. This is Sawa Kego. She has repented. Oh, she had it. Hell. I will never believe anything you tell me about Makego. If she lie, let her come and lie down here and say, hey, peace, I'm sorry. I will never believe her. Makai, hey. I've always known you to be a doubting police. You hardly believe things. But you see this one, you must believe it. Sister Makego has changed. I will not believe it. You know why I will not believe it? You see this world is very strange. Even this son you're looking now. You don't even know whether it's morning, you don't even know whether it's afternoon, or you don't even know whether it's already getting late. That is how life changes. Uh -huh. That is how life is. Nobody is to be trusted. I am telling you, you'll be here opening your mouth. <laughs> oh, I'm wow. so happy. I'm happy for you, my sister. There's nothing that is making me happy that you're smiling. I Please keep smiling. God. So Sawakego has changed. In Indeed, change is constant. Hey. Uh, assuming that I am the first son of this family, do you think I will integrate it or disintegrate the family? No, no. I know you very well. Uh, you coordinate this family now and bring us all together. Thank you. So what difference does he make now that I am the first child and the woman? Nothing, sister. This is just mere confusion. Confusion? Mm. What confusion are we talking about here? Listen, as a woman and the first child, I have decided that I should encourage Akudo not for Twitter. Well, sister, thank you very much for realizing this. I believe this new development is in favor of me. <laughs> no, 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 no. It is for the good of our father's family. Hmm? And I have decided to throw my weight behind anything that will help Akudo to conceive. I'll do it. Thank you very much, sister. Thank you. There's no need to thank me. I mean, it is my responsibility as the first child of this family. And I have decided to carry the burden to the best of my knowledge. So no need to thank me. And come to think of it. My kids are now grown up. I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you. I'm very sure that that boy will be missing me by now. I don't know what I'll do with that boy. He always wants to be around me. That's yeah? the same way I used to do then now. <laughs> it is true. I used to it cry every time she's traveling. <laughs> Once more, you're highly welcome, man. <laughs> Thank you very much. So tell me, how are your people? I hope they are as beautiful as you are. They look healthier and more beautiful than I. <laughs> In that case, they are highly favored. Hmm? <laughs> Thank you, man. Babe, I'll be inside. In case you need anything. Excellent. I'll be Thank at your service, okay? Thank you, my love. 
after. Yeah. See you guys later. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sister. Well, she's um, Clara Johnson from Kaduna State. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> I knew you were going to do that, but she's she's a good girl. Trust me. Yes. You did not see you people. You know what they say about love, sister. Now, eh? Understand. Oh, I understand. <laughs> well, her father is a general in the army, strong man. No? Her mother is a banker, a bank manager actually. Um, mm. General in the army. Strong man. <laughs> no, no, no. I can't mess up now. Okay. I can't mess up. <laughs> so tell me, how long have you people dated? We've been dating for four years now. Oh. I actually proposed to her last year. Did she agree? Who will not accept my proposal? <laughs> Who will not? I'm a fine boy in a bear. Hey, you know. I'm a fine boy in a That is why um, I actually brought her back so that you get to meet her and then start making plans for. Marriage. Mm. Can we now? Very important. Very, very important. Very important. Eh? So that you will uh, go. Yes. Yes. We want to see children running around the whole place. Of course. Eh? Of course. Come on, now, Hey. And the way yeah. I am seeing this girl, mm. with the way her backside is shaped, she looks like someone that will not even waste time to give birth. <laughs> hey! We can cry and I'll be a young that is what I want. It's okay. It's okay. That is very good to know. So tell me, tell me more. Tell me about your childhood. As a daughter of a soldier, I have been living from barrack to barrack. Oh. From one state to the other. Ah. In fact, I'm a barrack lady for sure. Really? <laughs> so, how do you intend to cope with marrying a Nibo man? And at least you know that there's a significant difference in culture, tradition, religion, status, and the rest. As my name implies, I am a Christian. Very good. Very good. As for status, it makes no difference. Hence, Ham is willing to do his duty as a husband, and I do mine as wife. Chicken, there will be no problem. <laughs> <laughs> you are a very intelligent lady, I must say. Mm. Honestly. So, what is your take on tradition? You know, in this part of the country, we guard our tradition jealously. Ma, I don't give a hoot about tradition. After all, Aham and I are not going to stay in this village. So, the tradition can go to hell. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Are you aware that Aham mm. is the only son of this family and my only brother? I know that. As for tradition, it makes no difference to my notion. Please arrest my kids. <laughs> <laughs> Madam Lawyer! Mm. Madam Lawyer! My beautiful sister Eva. <laughs> <laughs> and I can't wait to be with you. <laughs> In a song, Kiwalahi. Mm. Uh, Whatever that Do you understand means. what I say? I, I, I say you are beautiful and I love you. Oh, <laughs> oh, that is so heartwarming. Don't worry, I'll teach you a language, okay? I can't wait to learn. Okay. <laughs>
your back. Did you let her see him? You may fake fools. Yeah. Aham. Sister. What is this thing that I'm seeing here? Hey, hey! Ahamu! Ahamu! In the name of God that we both serve, don't tell me it is Clara's pants that you are washing and spreading here. Yes, now, sister. This is these are designer's pants I bought for her. Yeah? There's nothing there now. I decided to wash for my wife. That is what we call sweet love. It's foreign love. And not all these local champions. It's a love. yes now. By yes. the way, where is she? Sister, she's taking a nap inside. She's soaked this pants for like three days now. So I decided to help her, you know, wash it off since she's my wife now. My wife to be. Chero, she is inside. Yes. Having a nap. Resting. But it is you that will wash pants, Baroka. Pants that she soaked for three days. Sister Baroka, these are designer's pants I bought for her now. Uchono, Aneku, Aneku. As in the way you're saying it, it's like your head is telling you that what you're doing is correct. You are washing a woman's part for her. If you don't know eh? Do you know what it means? That man has gone. Sister, forget this thing you're saying. So many men wash pants. Is it because you see them just uh, carrying their shoes outside? So many men used to wash pants, John. Hey! I know this thing now. They'll just come outside and start pretending as if they, they don't used to wash pants normally. Hmm. Normally, inside the house, they wash pants. Let me fe they even wash more than pants. And ask me if you hey, come outside and be. Anyway, that one is by the way. Why did you not tell me that uncle has been sick since? Hey! Ah, sister, that, that skipped my mind though. Uncle has been so sick. As in, the sickness is consuming lots of money. Do you know that the last time I came back, I was the one that rushed into the hospital? Hey! Ha! Ah, wow. We need to pray. We need to pray for, for a miracle. That man there is our only uncle. Yeah, our pray. own father's younger brother. Eh? Yeah, I've been praying, no. I'm praying for him. Don't worry. I can't go out your pants. Come on, get out of office, sir. You are still touching that useless pants. Eh? Just that one will not happen in this house. Stop calling this thing useless pants. This is a designer's pants I bought now. Come on, Yeah! Yes, they that are 17 she pants. She all these things for three days. Sister, it's just 17 pants inside that place. What do you mean? It's a whole group of pants. You need a to fuck. You need a little bit of a pants. Oh, you should have washed it. Oh, you should have washed it. It will not work in this household. Let this be the first and the last time she will wash, you will wash any woman's part in this house. Oh, man, man, man. You know how disgraceful it is that my own younger brother is washing pants for a woman. Yeah, Sister, it's not no. disgraceful now. No, and the worst part is that I don't need to wash your own sorry, your pants. It will not happen. Hey, Yeah, Clara. Clara. Sister, leave, leave, leave my wife. Oh. Mm. Um, ma, mm. I'll be leaving first thing in the morning. I have a court session, and my client has been on my neck to come back. Oh, ah, is that your agreement with her? Sister, mm. duty calls, and I cannot stop her. Mm. Besides, we have achieved the reason for her visit, so. Ah, that is very correct. Mm. I mean, she has seen me, and she has seen other members of the family. Of course. Me, it's okay. It's left for us to also return the visit. See your people, sit down and discuss with them, so that you know. From there, we will know the way forward. Hmm? It's all right. Sir. Please, I should be informed on time, oh. so I will get across to my father. He hardly stays in town. He's a busy man. <laughs> yes. I can imagine. I can imagine. That is not a problem. Hmm? Um. By the way, it was really nice seeing you. Thank you very much. I'm honored. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. <laughs> Sister, mm -hmm. don't forget though mm. that as a man, no matter the number of years you see me with, mm. I am still a man. Okay. Yes, now mm -hmm. I have my muscles. I can flex them anytime I want to. <laughs> I'm still the man. That was that time. Oh. That was then. You see now, if you try it, if you flex this your muscle now. <laughs> Not only will my husband imprison you, <laughs> you see my children. <laughs> mm. They will gather you up. They will gather and beat you blue and black. You see this, your muscles, they will deflate it for you. Sister, I should have just told me that you're raising a gang in Lagos. Oh. Eh, let me understand you now. That is what I'm raising. You should have told me you're raising a gang in Lagos. But I'm here. <laughs> 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 
Ah, Ibu on that dog or one. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, my dear. You will live long life, oh. Come and see it, come and see it, come and see it. Um, this is the food I was telling you about. Ah. Food I have labor. Tested and trusted. The villagers confirmed that she is well trained. In fact, since she's the daughter of the son, she is enmeshed in custom and tradition. She knows everything about our tradition. Try. Hell! Uh, you're welcome, the... eh? Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> you're Hi. welcome. Good to see you. Um, uh. Akudo, you're welcome. You see, my sister here, my loving sister, my sweet sister has told me a lot about you. Eh? But um, notwithstanding, I still told her that I have someone I'm already dating. But she insisted. And I am still insisting. Mm. You are my only brother. And I know what is good for you. <laughs> Eh? I can see that. I can see that. Can see that. <laughs> Sister, it's, it's, it's all right. Um, mm. I, I thank God Akudo is here. Um, it's nice to meet you. At the same time, um, I still need time to discuss with her. So we'll get to know each other one on one. Ah, After all, she's the, the she's a point of view. Eh? I don't have a problem. I can excuse you to, so that you can talk and know each other well. Hmm? No, no, sister. What kind of arrow is that? Why will you, why will you commit such abomination? How can I be here and then you excuse us? No, the best thing is for me and her to work out, you know, have a little discussion, get to know each other better, and that does it. Yeah. They will start planning I, ahead now. I could. Hey, bro. <laughs> hey, look at me. Look at me. Look at this. I can burn your job. So I do not offer you to watch it. I'm fine, thank you. Man. We are now family. Okay? Thank you, man. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. You see that thing that I'm telling you? <laughs> Sister, 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 Hey, I don't know what I've tried. Um, Akudo, you know, it's so funny you grew up in this village and I never got to meet you. Well, it's not my making. My late father was a very strict Catholic catechist who never liked his children mingling with villagers. Uh, why was that? He always say that evil communication corrupts good manners. <laughs> <laughs> well, although I knew him when he was alive, I never knew he was um, this strict. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> it did not just end at home. It continued to our school. Do you know that Papa will take my sister and I to school and then come back afterwards to pick us? He even paid some masters to be monitoring us. <laughs> <laughs> Did the surveillance get to that? She never can tell with Papa. It was bitter while it lasted, but it is life saving. Of course. It helped keep my sister and I. I can see that already. <laughs> eh? <laughs> um, Akudo, what do you think about what my sister is saying about us getting married? What's your take? Although I may not understand what you are saying, but I want to tell you that. Your sister Wakiego has, for over two years now, been telling me that I will marry her brother. And she has been spending on me. Whoa! <laughs> Tell me something I do not know. Hmm? Well, that is true now. It's the truth. I accepted her request, spending on when I would see the said brother. 
because my uncle said you are a good man. Whoa. Now I see this marriage has already been concluded behind my back. <laughs> That's good to know though. Good to know. <laughs> Sister Wakego, you beat me to this one. Mm -hmm. Do you know you already married them, Akudo? Behind me without my consent? Yes, sir. Huh. I had to do what I did so that she would not get married to another man. You know that Akudo, her type is rare. You can't find them like that these days again. Mona Wagi. Sister, you sound as if you know this girl too well. If I say I know her too well, it is not a lie. And judging by her parents and how we regard them, how they are. Mm. Ha! That Akudo is one in a million. Mona Wagi. I won't be shocked if you find her a virgin. Da! Eh? Sister, that is a lie. <laughs> ah, it's a... You're trying to tell me that a girl as fine as Akudo is still a virgin. No, ah. now. How, how can that happen? Are you telling me you paid other men not to, to look at her? <laughs> it's not possible now. My dear brother, the taste of the food is in the eating. Just try it. A trial will convince you. I know what I'm saying. Uh -uh. You're okay. serious about this? Okay, I'm going to Okay, I'm to Hey! Sister? Eh? Do you know I finally tasted Akudo? That girl is still intact. Though. Follow come! Oh. Did I not tell you? Agwa and Agwa. It wasn't, it wasn't as if I knew. But judging from her upbringing, I knew she would be a virgin. Chad, sister, I tried too much for me. <laughs> Thank you for connecting the both of us. I'm just wondering what my life would have been if I had ended up with that Clara girl. Why do you say that? Do you know that as we speak, she's in her third marriage? It's again. <laughs> what do you mean by that? Clara is in the business of marrying and divorcing. Yay! The last time we spoke, she told me she can never surrender her, her freedom to any man. You don't mean? Yes, so. Imagine what would have happened to you if you had married her in this your present financial condition. Sister, six feet. I would have gone six feet and by now my memories would have been forgotten. Hi. Just like that. Imagine me watching my brother wash the ladies on the wear pants, brand and those. Yeah, hello. Forget that memory. Mm -mm. That's hello. not the memory I want you to have. That was suffering and smiling. I, oh. I was managing my life now. Oi, Bob. Hello. Hello, Mama. And the ancestors of this land accept this big sacrifice. Amen. I could do it is not them. It is Ise. Uncle. Ise. Ise. But Uncle, what's the difference between Amen and Ise? Amen is for you, the believers and Christians. Ise is for we, the traditionalists. Hi. <laughs> Akugo, you. you're welcome. Thank you, Uncle. Uh, yes, I received your message. Uh, that is why I have to step back. Yes, I could have joined my wife at the farm. Oh, Uncle, I am so happy. That is why I said, let me come and share this testimony with you. It is about my sister-in-law, Mwakego. Uncle, she has turned a new leaf. She no longer gives me troubles. In fact, she now carries me like an egg. Like a And my wife is Hey! Just like what she saw before she recommended you for marriage. Yes, eh? <laughs> I think this is a welcome development. Mm. You know, when Peace told me about it, I said, no, I have to see you if I believe. Uncle, it is a dream come true. Sincerely, Sister Makego surprised every one of us by her change of attitude towards me. Mm. Hey, she has now gone back to the way she was before she recommended me. She came here now. 
You should come here begging me. Uncle, please allow us to marry. Hey, hey. <laughs> so, uh, you can, now, Akodo, can you see that the cost of this land, I'm up asleep. And my continuous problem of liberation is paying off. Uncle, don't even go there. Hmm? Don't attribute God's glory to your ancestors. You see, until one goes changing, hmm. it is a miracle directly from God. You see your, you see your life? A few seconds ago, you asked me, Uncle, what is the difference between Amin and the son? Hmm? You don't know what there is. What do you understand by miracle? Hmm? Can't you see that the gods of this land at work? And I pray they will complete their good works on you. <laughs> say amen. Say. <laughs> you are still busy. Hmm. We, are, we are still busy. Busy, mom. Hmm? Are, you, are you done? Yes, I'm done. Here you go, Kifa. Uh -uh. It's not for my can. Uh, why are you, you go? <laughs> Sister, <laughs> oh, yeah, now continue with Uncle when you're done. I'm inside. Please, why are you, mom? Uh, we're almost done. But I will call you when you're almost done. Uh -huh. uh, so. uh, uh, you said something about our father's land at Umuke. Umuke. Yeah. Uh, land it well, Umuke. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, okay, see, there's some of you here who came here the other day asking whether we're interested in selling the land. Mm -hmm. uh, that is, he will buy mm -hmm. if we have. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uncle, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I did not allow you to finish. My number. I'm a number one yard of book one. But you see this one, it's not for sale. Mm. Have you forgotten what our late father said about the land? He said that one, we will sell it and use it for my younger sister's education. Uh, that is to say that eventually we will still sell it. Yes, but not now. Mm. It's no, it's not a, now. Is that your final word? Yes, uncle. Uh -huh. Let it be now. Hey, oh. oh, I thank God. Mm -hmm. I th you're happy you. now. I'm very happy. <laughs> hey, hey, and you're oh, well. very <laughs> I know how things are for you financially right now, so I want to shoulder the financial responsibility of any expenses we will incur to make sure that your wife gets pregnant. Sister Wakego. Yeah. Hey! Sister Wakego has done it again. <laughs> Sister Wakego has done it again. Ah! Sister Wakego. God will bless you. God will bless you and bless you and bless you. Uh -huh. You will grow older than Methuselah himself. <laughs> uh -huh. Biko, Biko, there is no need to thank you. Hey. Don't thank me. Uh -uh. What I cannot do for you does not exist at all. Uh, don't you think that our parents will not be happy? They will punish me if I have money and ignore you. Yes, yeah, so, yeah, sister, they will punish you very well. Oh. Yeah. No, they will punish you now. It's, it's the truth now. They will punish you if you don't help me. Anyway, I don't think there is really any need for us to keep wasting time. Tomorrow, let's go to the city. We are in Yemen now. Yes, the earlier we tackle it, the better. Let's get to the city, go to a very good hospital. Let us start perhaps, you know, scanning and, um, you know, lab tests and things like that. At least let's know what the problem is and tackle it head on. Hey. Hey, water. Sister, huh? sister, thank you very much. <laughs> sister, thank you so much. Sweet. God bless you. Sweet. Hey, what would I have, what would I have done without it's you okay. now? What would I have done without yes, you? Yeah, sister, one thank one you. One name, one name, one name. I don't feel like standing again. Yeah, sister, so thank you, thank you, you thank want to make you. me feel bad now? Nah. I'm so emotional right now. <laughs> My sister has decided to take care of every medical expenses regards to your child business. It's a lie. It's not a lie. You know? Jesus! <laughs> Please, I told you! I told you that my sister-in-law's repentance is genuine in Afua. In the play, in the show. Let me tell me you are joking. I'm not joking, no. Hey. I just wish... Jesus. Uh, I just wish this is true. It's not as if I'm doing bad deleo, but this is exactly the way it should be. My dear, it doesn't <laughs> end there. It doesn't end there. She is ready to move immediately. 
How? <laughs> Tomorrow we're going to the city now to start running tests and doing all sorts of scans to make sure everything is in order. It's a lie. Uh-uh. Which one is the lie? It's a yeah. lie. So, you are telling me that aside her wanting to support us financially, she also wants to accompany us to the trip? Uh -uh. My dear, she assured me total commitment to this course until a solution is found. Jesus! <laughs> I am so happy, baby! I can't contain my joy! Why I contain it? Jesus! Hey, this is the best time to call Hanti Wakego. At least I'm not one of my day and I'm an old Ruyan. And I'm one thing on. Please, can you please not be a killjoy? I am happy. Your sister is happy. You should be happy for your sister. Honestly, I'm very, very happy. Hey, you know, no, no, you're not. I need to be sure that this. I need to be sure that this woman is real. She's too excited. Are you sure your sister has really changed? And she's going to do this? No, trust me, she has changed. Yeah. If she doesn't do it, my father's spirit will be down. that we are forgetting and it is a virtue we need to embrace and practice regularly <clears throat> um Kego, you know your judgment is always right please what is it prayer prayer the bible says that prayer is the key even as we are about to embark on this journey we should give everything into god's hands we should invite God so that he will take us there safely and make sure that we get positive results. Do you understand? Sister Wakego, I am forever indebted to God for this your new life. Eh? Hey! It's alright. Lead us in prayers, please. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Father, we bless you. We glorify your name. We worship you. May all adoration be ascribed unto your name in the name of Jesus. Amen. We commit this journey into your hands, Lord. Who is home? Who is here? You know, my sister was traveling, so she asked me to come and stay here and take care of their house for them. But you suppose let me know as your friend now. Ah, yes, you're right. Eh? My name and Yemma Dubuni did too much. Okotokari, this is my head, and I have a lot. Please forgive me, I forgot. Oh, it's true now. Eh? You know, I'm an orphan. So I have a lot to think, this, that, that, and I'm going to get back. I'm going to get back, people. Please, don't be sad here. Without letting your friend know your whereabouts. Joy, how are you going to get back with you? By the way, where is your warrior sister-in-law? Is she Aram? Sister Wakiko? Yes. She just say warrior sister-in-law. You know, I don't like embarrassment. Eh? Bam, 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 rephrase. You know what I rephrase? Sister Wakego, you know, is a changed person. <laughs> I'm telling you, she's changed now. Sister Wakego is the most reliable, trusted, as in what are you saying? Wakego and Kemma Kobo. Let me now shock you. Do you know that the same Sister Wakego, with her help, my sister, the husband, including herself, mm -hmm. they went to the city. So that they will start treating my sister's infidelity problem. Eh? 
Yes. Are you serious? All the problems that my sister have, they are in the city now treating it. Hey. I'm telling you, God will use Thank that God. one. She has changed. Firstly, I didn't believe her. But lately, I've seen that the change is permanent. My sister, why are you? Eh? How could you reach? Don't worry. I'm going to go to the air. The water is not Because what will I offer you now? Eh? Oh, thank God, though. <laughs> Sister, Don't worry, let me go and uh, bring something for you. I'm coming. Okay. Now, I understand the use of that uh, proverb. And that whatever the fight, but surely someday rest. That ha! is exactly what the bed bug told her children. When the bed owner pour hot water on them, mm. very hot water, mm. they change or bed bug call the kids and say, relax, mm. be calm, mm -hmm. be quiet. For whatever that is hot, must surely get cold. Good. Even a human being, hey. a standing breast will want their fault. Follow, follow, <laughs> follow, 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 do you know Honestly, that, do you know that she has started taking the responsibility, shouldering responsibilities of her hand. Every of her hand's financial problem now, she's shouldering it, paying off every bill. Uh -huh. uh, you don't know this, that woman. You may not know that all her children are in overseas studying. But she's rich. Oh. They are extra rich, super rich. Even the stranded husband eh, is the richest man in their community. Oh, no, <laughs> uh -huh. You may not know. <laughs> now you, that means, uh, uh, in that case, you should invite your in-law mm. hmm? and advise him to make good use of this opportunity, you know, to re-establish himself. In humility. In uh, humility. Huh? Uh. See, if our farm failed to learn on the years of experience, his business crashed and collapsed in the city, and he had been home, suffering poverty. Eh? If you fail to learn by experience, you know that he's a fool. Ah. He doesn't need further advice. Mpana, Mpana, don't say so. Eh? Don't say so. No man is a monopoly of wisdom eh? or knowledge. So you need to call him, talk to him. Papa Yoko, I'm mad at you. I'm going to do a lot of work. Okay. When last did you go on? Yeah. Hey, Yaka. Hey, Yaka. Hey, Yaka. Hey, Yaka. Hey, Yaka. It's a bit long, though. Yeah, Mama. Every time you play, you play. Why are you here? Why are you here? I could do. Make sure you take these drugs the same way the doctor prescribed it. Then you go try, yeah. See, if you do it religiously, eh? One day, hmm, you will carry your own child in your own arms. And I mean, I pray. Until I can go, I pray. If I may ask, what could be the cause of the hormonal imbalance? You can ask your brother, Ham. He is the first. And only man I have known all my life. It's okay, we him God. It's okay, it doesn't matter. Hmm? Listen, who are we to question God? Does a pot question the potter? Mbano. Mm -hmm. huh. What gave the pot the power to question his maker? Exactly. That is the same thing with God. Eh? Happen you, Omegi. He is the only one that has the power to dry up an ocean. The only one that has the power. To even fill a wilderness with water. In Anuia, take your drugs religiously and be prayerful. Hapu Zeru Chukwoku. Eh? Leave everything to him. Expect a miracle. Eh, eh, kita kibia. Mbangwa ngoda, ngoda, ngoda. Ngoda. Mm-hmm. Ine, miya kofela ahu. Eh? You have done it. Eh, eh. Ngotopo, ngotopo, ngotopo. Drink water so that it will push the drug down. Eh, eh, ibia. It's okay, no, it's okay. Hmm? It'll be okay. Nani? Okay. So when it's time for your next dose, don't worry. I will bring the drugs myself. Each one here, I will force you to drink it. You must give bet in this house, as far as I'm concerned. Hey, Nugo. Auntie Mwaka. Thank you. I am so grateful. Thank you for stepping into our matter. If not for your intervention, 
your brother and I will still be wallowing in self-medication due to poverty. Why do you people always do this? Eh? Do you know that any time I do anything for you and you people start thanking me or your husband start thanking me, make me feel as if I am a stranger in this family. Kubani, don't see it that way. One has to be appreciative. Mm. Even God loves being appreciated. <laughs> we merry go. He merry go. Eh? You have a superior argument. And I accept it. It is fine. Mm? But whatever you do, always remember that we are family and we are one blood. In Anwia. So so why do you come? I'm not going with that first step. Let me find something. You are tired, you know. Oh, I'm going to man. We need to come now. Please. Do you know that before God and man? Hmm. Hmm? Mm. If I bounce back to wealth tomorrow, I'll send you abroad for studies. Eh? Yes, now. Oh God. <laughs> you will send me to Bodo Ibo. <laughs> you will send me to Bodo Ibo to go and study. You hey! think I'm joking? Are you serious? Hmm? Do you think I'm joking? Hey! My dear, I will send you to the Great Britain. So hey. you go and acquire better knowledge like all this in it when it's you know british british english yeah. instead of spending time here and suffering um strike up and down ah. this country is just anyhow okay. hey, if you know how happy i am eh, this thing you just said eh, <laughs> i am so happy i'll go to bodo evil uh, i'll be saying in it in it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, even my wife now. Hey. Let's assume she gets pregnant. Mm. Eh? And money comes back. I'll send her abroad now. She'll go and give birth to the child in America. You mm. become an American citizen. Child. Hmm? Mm? Don't worry. Don't worry. You may need basic with them, mad. You're a good man. God is going to make everything to be perfect. You see your wife? She's going to have plenty of children for you. Amen. Eh? All of us will go to Bodo Yubo. We'll go there and say, Ine. I say, very, very. I say, very, very, very. My dear. Poverty is a bastard. Hmm. I don't wish it for even my enemies. Hmm. I don't. Ha. Huh. Very bad though. And you know the worst of it? The part that you've even enjoyed wealth, and then you're falling back to square one, like if you do one issue. My dear, that is the worst of all of them. Huh? That's the worst of it all now. Eh? That is the reason for suicide in our community these days. Oh, why? Yes, now. What else? You just have BP, um, depression. Hmm. Before you know it, the person will just commit suicide. All of these are attributes of poverty. Hi. Poverty is a bad thing. Poverty. Haji. It is well. We shall make it. Amen. Sister, you called me. Yes. Okay. Peace. You know God has a reason for making you and I the only surviving children of our late parents. <laughs> You're right. That is why he is the omnipotent and omniscience God. He knows the end from the beginning. Yeah. <laughs> I'm happy you understand. Of course. See what I've been through. All I've suffered as a result of my barrenness. Of oh God. God forbid. Don't say that. Who said you're barren? You're not a barren woman. You're just an expectant mother. That is who you are. Don't ever call yourself barren again. 
I'm sorry for my choice of words. I'm sorry. But if only one could see the future. If I had known things would turn out this way, I would have enjoyed life as a spinster with my mates. Sister, honestly, I don't like this thing you're saying. But if you're going to continue sucking and continue this, I will just go inside and take my bag and then get out of your house. What is wrong with you? Just take a look at you. What is your problem? I'm sorry. Sorry for my outburst. <laughs> Just that. This world we live in is a funny place. A very funny place. A world where prostitutes give birth to children. People who do not want to give birth give birth to children while the virgin goes childless. It is fine. Hmm? One name. Odina. Don't worry. Divine visitation is on his way to your house. Can't you see it? Can't you feel it? Amen. Our God is alive. I claim it. Please, stop it. I know God will not forsake me. Never. I know He will not disappoint me. way. I don't like these tears and everything. Stop, stop being negative. Be positive always. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, the thing is that I went to see a doctor. He said I need bed rest. And then that's why I sent for you because I want to ask you for a favor. Please don't say no. Please. Sister, what is it? I want you to move in here with us permanently so that you can be helping me out with the house chores. This one is difficult to Go. Go. is difficult because I have things I'm doing, but I know, but the bed rest will help me. Let it's me see if okay. I can consider. It's fine. I will do it for you and for the family. I will stay. At least let it be the major help. You know, I did for you. Well, promise me you will not be crying. If you cry, I'll cry my bag and go. I will cry. Thank <laughs> you. Thank you so much. You're welcome, one name. If there is to be another life, I will choose you over and over mm. and over again as my sister. I will choose you too as my lovely sister. <laughs> Come here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh -huh. Uncle, here we are. May the spirit of my late brother Ayan and our ancestors accept this libation. You say. Uh -huh. So. Ah, I'm a fool. Thank you very much. Hey, thank you very much, Uncle. Um, Uncle, I want to thank you for honoring my invitation. You know, you have been very nice to us ever since we lost our parents. So, thank you very much. Ah. Uh -huh. I have to thank you also. You see, 
This is an obligation that I must do. Oh yes. I wish you witnessed the kind of love that existed between your late father, my brother, when he was alive. I am. We were the envy of every family in this community. Oh yes. We were so united and so inseparable. Hey! Death. You are so cruel. Oh. Um, hey! I am. Oh. Genika Mary. Gio. Genika Mary. Genika Mary. Gio. Hey! I am. I am. I have to join my brother at this moment. Uh, oh, this is. Uh, Uncle, how can I'm you say like my that? Brother. Now? I, I, I am Kevin. Oh, no, 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 Uncle. Why, why would you say things like this now? You want to join my parents? How? We are still trying to recover from the loss of my parents, and you're saying you want to join them? How? Why? Uncle, please don't say that again. Don't say it again, please. Um, um, you won't understand what I'm missing. Yes. You see, I try so hard to make sure that I am live, but everything prove abortive. Yes. I try everything, but all my effort amounts to zero. You see, Wakaiko, she's a great encouragement. We fought together, but death was stronger. It's all right, Uncle. I am. It's all right. Um, I actually called you here to tell you that my sister has taken a new name. As a matter of fact, she has agreed to financially assist me. Ah! Okay. Ezioku? Yes. Ah. Really? Hey! Hey! I know! Hey, I am. I'm so happy to hear this. So, did she promise to give you money to go and establish in the city? Yes, uncle. Hey. She even gave me back all the documents um, regards to all my father's properties. But she pleaded with me not to sell them. That she's ready to financially assist me to any level I want. Hey. You know, I'm hey. happy. I'm happy. Hey, okay, go better. Hey. I am adding very, very happy. Me too. Udo, Udo, I am Udo Gadi. Ebe Uda Yadi, Ema Udo Gadi. Yay! Udo, Udo, Udo Gadi. Ebe Uda Yadi, Ema Udo Gadi. I sincerely want to apologize for the insult I gave you by slapping Ahamefula in front of you. Where can you go? You see, you don't have to worry about that. Hmm? The most important thing is you realized your mistake and has apologized. Yes, I really do realize my mistakes. You know, I was really blinded by my ignorance and pride and that was why I was fighting Akudo unnecessarily. I realize that now. Okay, go. <laughs> you see, I want to thank you for all the good things you've been doing for Ahamifula. He told me everything. <sighs> I also want to thank you for taking his wife for proper attention. May God bless you. So Akudo, may I remind you what I told you the last time you visited? I told you that our family is known for procreation. There is no lady that has been married out of this family who did not bear children. My wife can attest to that. Akudo, your uncle is right. In fact, I can attest to that. Hmm? Ever since I'm married here, I have never seen or heard about any barren, barren woman or whatever. Not even one. Not, not at no, Baron. Hmm? Then what shall I attribute my own case to? I'm tired. Honestly, Kagugum, 
I am tired of this situation. Upon how I reserved myself. You can't go again again me. Eh? Uncle, please. I want you to beg Akudo here to resist from all those unholy utterances. Else, you will cease to be my sister. Inano? Akudo. Peace is right. Eh? See, just be positive. As a man thinketh in his heart, so he is. Whatever you say to yourself, eh? That is it. Eh? Please. Listen to my wife, be positive. You know, this is the problem I have with you Christians. Faithlessness. You don't have faith at all. But if one to see you is shouting and saying, I claim it in the name of Jesus. I claim it. Now seeing you wombo being amazed over a little trial. A little trial. You could not hold your faith again. You could not believe that same God you call day and night. I mean, is it not shameful? Hi. It's even annoying. Very, very annoying. Huh? Ask her. Akudo, let me ask you. Let me put it to you. How old are you? No, tell me. How old are you, both in age and in marriage? That you're busy screaming and barren. Barrenness this. Barrenness that. You see, that's why you need to go with her. So that you encourage her with the word of God. Eh? What God cannot do does not exist. Because, eh? Mm. Now, Akudo, may I, may I assure you, as the only surviving uncle you have, yeah. I want to say that, Akudo, in no distant time, you are going to carry your own child. Amen. 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 Thank you so much, uncle. Thank you, Mommy Kiru. Like I said earlier, the doctor instructed I take a bed rest. Hence, I request that peace move in with me. So as to help out with some house chores and other things. Kiru, William. I'll get my cup with man. I let her not just overflow the issue. Peace here is your sister. I have no problems that she go with you. So you have my permission. So peace. You have to go and get prepared. But remember that from time to time, she'll be coming to weed and to keep your father's company clean. Again, what am I doing? Uh, I will do everything. Eh? Just peace. Make sure that nothing troubles your sister. Hmm? Because no problem. Thank you so much. God bless you. Thank you, Uncle. You're welcome, my young man. Uh, so, um, peace. Sir? Uh, uh, you see, uh, this idea of uh, peace, moving in with Akudo, uh, is superb. What you very, very superb. Eh? But uh, I am not too comfortable with it. It's okay. Why are you not comfortable with it, Nkiru? What's the problem then? Because I'm thinking Akudo should have gone to look for us. Young, younger girl, a eh? small girl, that will serve her instead of her uh, uh, sister a uh, uh, piece. Eh? See, um, Kiru, will you shut up if you don't know what to say? This is one habit or character I see in you that I hate. You are too pessimistic. Pessimism is your other name. Why would Akudo go there spending money? Looking for a, a house help when she has a grown sister who can do the job. Uh, nah, there's nothing like pessimism here. And why had the pessimism in Mifa? Eh? This should have been here, you know, be useful to herself, not going to become a servant or serve her sister. Mm. Oh, you're more new. Mm. Uh, that is the essence of what and I'm saying. serving her sister will make her useless. Listen to me. Peace leaving this family is a sweet relief to me. Do you think it is easy to feel an adult like her, like peace? It's not easy for me. No. Hey. But you know what? Don't tell me it's because of the occasional meal we give to peace that they stated your horrid consent. What was you? When I? Um, Giro, go to the kitchen and prepare my lunch. Else I'll call my kids and tell them that you are starving me. And what are you saying now? No, my father, I don't know. What else will you do if not to blackmail me with your cheap 
black bear. Come get inside and prepare my food. No, be here. I'm exchanging words with me. Get inside. Do you think it's easy? Ah, no, 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 stop, 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 please, stop. What are you talking? What are you doing now? Baby, what's the meaning of this? You like stress too much. You like stressing yourself too much. The doctor warned that I shouldn't allow you to stress yourself again. You're not supposed to stress yourself. Just open your mouth. Does and that eat. include feeding myself? Yes! It includes feeding yourself. So open your mouth, let me feed you. Yeah. Yeah? I want to feed you and feed you. Once we're done here, I will carry you straight to the bathroom. <laughs> Wash you very well. Bait you very, very well. Sparkling clean. <laughs> then I'll carry you to the bed. Boah. I'll do my job. And by so doing. You are turning me into a lazy bone that cannot even lift a broomstick. It is not your burden, it is my burden. Let me carry it. Huh. Eh? What is your problem, sir? I don't understand. You are broomstick. Did I use broomstick to, to jazz you? Eh? Must you sweep everything? <laughs> if they leave you, you will sweep, go, go outside and sweep the main room. <laughs> I don't understand. Ever since your parents died, you've been stressing yourself. Now I have married you to give you a better life. You still came here and you started stressing yourself like your one house girl. Eh? You sweep here, you sweep there. If they leave you, go and sweep the neighbor's house too. Eh? No now. Please, I don't want this stress here. Open your mouth. Eat this food, JJP. Mm. This hand you're bringing. You see this hand you're bringing? Mother Papa also. You should not complain in future. My dear, I'm not going to complain. I will not complain. I will continue doing this until I hear the cry of a baby in this house. May Paul no open your mouth. Ah, yes, that's the only thing you should be doing. Just open your mouth and I'll feed you. Ah, let me even call peace to bring more food. This is this food is too small now. Mm -mm. Eh? Baby, stop now. I've not even eaten half of the one in the place. You want to call peace to bring more. Do you want to overfeed me? It's all right. Oh yeah. And yes. Very soon, we will carry our children. Amen. Amen. Oh, yeah. Eat. Mm. Hurry up so that we go and go to the bathroom. I want water. You want water? Mm. Is it this one here? Or you want me to go to the stream to get water? water. Yes, water here. Don't go to any stream. <laughs> so, you know, I'm ready for this walk. Clean my mouth. I think that one is a problem. <laughs> and Tinwa Kego, honestly, marriage couldn't be any better. In fact, since I married your brother Ahamefula, even when he was rich that we were living in the city, I have never, yeah, I have never enjoyed my marriage in sweet and loving terms like this period. I'm telling you, that is good to know. <laughs> What of from Ken? No. Superb! Superb! Chima! I do not care! I do not Superb! Yeah! Gambo, eh? Dachi! Ebano! Hmm! Do you know that it is now that I know the pleasure of a woman sleeping with her husband? The cuddling, the touches, and the kisses and the doing. The doing is that what I'm doing. The doing is that what I'm doing. The doing makes me want to touch the rainbow. Do you know I cry for more like Oliver Twist? Who am I going to move? Who am I going to move? Okay, in that case, I will tell my brother to give you more than you ask for. Eh, what will you feel now? Four, four. He'll be giving it to you. Four, four. Then I'll just pass it to I do okay, because I'm not four. If that happens, that means we we'll ask the government for the assistance ah. in training them. No need. No need. Even if they like, let them be coming out ten times. I can't even open it. I will take care of them to the last without shaking. I'm not even feeling a toy for. I'm so happy. That is the most important thing. You enjoying your marriage. 
And with this peace of mind that you have now, trust me, it will be easier for children to implant inside your womb. Hmm? Sister Ma, conceive in Jesus' name. Amen. Conceive. That's why I can wait, Jima. I can wait. More than twins. I can't wait. <laughs> it will happen. Don't worry. Amen. <sighs> Let me go and see my love. Mm. I'm, I'm not peace, eh? Peace must have eh? given him the beating of his life, Nada Ludo. <laughs> Wait for some man, bro Ludo. No problem. Let Please. me see my go. baby. Tell my sister. Maybe he was on a man, bro. It's okay. Chai. What kind of nonsense is this? <laughs> I don't understand. Why? Six will never come. Six will never come. <laughs> my in law. Eh? Don't worry. Nye nga wagi kitabo, eh? Extra three knots. Hehehe! You maka nita wani gya 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 Ngo! Wudia wudia wudia! Hmm! Nye nye! I'm not playing again no. I'm not playing this nonsense game again. Six five! I said I am not playing again no. Six five! Wudia wudia! Nye wudia! Eh kwonja! I'm not playing again. I've told you this thing. I'm not just starting my life, please. Oh, why, you know, why are you doing like this? Eh? Oh, God, we'll show you. you know that I always win in this game. You can never win me in this game. Eh? Even tomorrow, next tomorrow, I will always win you. My dad only won me today. What about tomorrow? Eh? Tomorrow is pregnant. What about tomorrow? <laughs> Your tomorrow is always pregnant. Okay, my in law, no problem. Sorry that I won you. So continue with your lecture about uh, marriage. I yeah. was learning something that time. Now you're talking. <laughs> Not this nonsense game. Uh, what I was saying about marriage is always make sure you marry whosoever it is for love okay. and not for money. Because if you marry for money, <laughs> money must go anytime. Nothing is left. Imagine your sister married me for money. She would have left me by now now. <laughs> Who will stay with a man like me? <laughs> my in law, how will how will you, you know, know that uh, this is natural pure love? Uh-huh. Why you love someone for nothing exactly? That is what is called unconditional love. Yeah. Yes, true love. Loving someone for nothing. Just just love you just see the person, just love the person. Yes. Ha, ah, well, you know, does that mean um, that was why, you know, you, you love my sister very well? Ha, ah, everything. <laughs> what, what, are you, what, what do you mean by her everything? No, I'm just asking. I, 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 don't, I don't know where you're going to. I love your sister naturally. I love her so. <laughs> I love her. <laughs> I'm giving it to you, where where? Sister, I will go more at train. No, such a me walk another one. One for the road. This is what you just did today. What about tomorrow? Ah. I always tell you people tomorrow is pregnant, but you don't listen. Tomorrow is pre what happens tomorrow? Oh, yeah. eh? Because you beat me three or today, you think you beat me three or tomorrow. I'll go back there. <laughs> Baby, this or tomorrow does it ever come? Every time tomorrow pregnant. Now we can't say we can't go in there. Oh boy, you're wicked. Eh? Very wicked. Eh? You're winning my husband. Three zero. You did not even allow him to win once. After a joke, I could not even rude him. Baby. My baby, don't worry. Tomorrow, tomorrow, I'll join you. Eh? One for the road. Come back, get it. What is on My love, do you know that Sister Makego is filthy rich? She said she has been living this kind of lifestyle so as not to attract negative energies. No, Imago, dilo. <laughs> Do you know she's into all your business? Eh? What Kego told you all of this? Will I be lying to you? I believe it was God that touched her and made that speak to me about it. 
then why is she allowing us to suffer in poverty like this now? I asked her the same question. But she refused to give me a straight answer. Rather, she said that all her assets will be willed to our children because her husband is filthy rich. Don't you think I should ask her for some money so I can go back to the city and reestablish myself? Bam, bam, bam. Hey, not now. If you do that, she will see me as a gossip. Just allow her to make decisions by herself. You're right. You're very right. Or you business. Wow. Are, are you not feeling good? No, I don't. I don't think you're wearing. I, this all this piece now. Things will be biting you. You know, I, you know this. The doctor has warned me already, and you just want to stress me. Uh, eh? Please look at. Please come. Let's go inside. So you take a nap. Baby, I'm okay here. No, you're not okay. I need you to rest. You like, like by by this time you're supposed to be resting. Eh? People who are jebo are always they rest by this time. They nap, then wake up maybe around around seven p.m. again. They sleep. Meanwhile, how did you even get here? Did you, did you use cab to get to this place? Because I told you to stop walking up and down inside this compound. I tried. Come, 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 Wait, so. How do you mean put you in trouble? Wait, 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 wait. Is Peter asking you out? For where? Babe, do you know how many times he calls me in a day? Even in old hours, asking about you. Peter? Hey, <laughs> hey. Is this stupid? Is, wait, though. Is something wrong with that boy? Eh? Is it stupid or something? Is he not aware that you stay with your parents? Why would he be calling you like that? On that poor again. The worst part of it is, he started visiting me in my house. Eh? <laughs> Babe, the last time he visited me, my fiance nearly caught him. I'm just telling you the truth. Hey, now I see that Peter is very stupid. He has gone out of his senses. Is something wrong with him? When he was busy giving me, eh, 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 I was busy giving him love, showing him love and affection. What did he do? He was taking me for granted. He took my love, my heart, everything. Busy giving me condition. Eh? You must give birth. You must be pregnant. You must be this. See, I am tired of that nonsense. So. I am tired. If you are tired of him, then pick his call and discharge him. Simple. See, eh? You have to discharge him for me. I don't have anything whatsoever to do with Peter. Nothing. So, anything you want, anyhow you feel like talking to him, please make sure to yell at him. Yes, so? Oh, because he's very stupid. It's love sweeter Our world is love sweeter Our love is love Sincerely speaking, you're looking more beautiful than before. Achalu Gumai. Tweto, which before are you talking about? You cannot compare now. Is it that before when I was I, I was living with your brother Ochoribum? Eh? 
he wanted to take my life because of an issue that I know nothing about. Hmm. You hmm. cannot compare. <laughs> Waka. Oh. That is why I am here. Yes. My brother called from his base, America, and ordered me to come and beg you for forgiveness. Your brother, how? Did he delete my number after he threw me out of the house without my children? Eh? He said that he's ashamed of himself. Hmm. That he's ashamed to call you or behold your beautiful face. Because of the decision he took against you without proper investigation. Huh. Hey! Do you know the disgrace your brother gave me? Do you know? Do you know the, the sleepless nights I went through because of him? Do you know how I begged him? I begged him and I asked him to change his mind over his decision. Ojo! Jo wasianya ekwonko. Eh? He stood his ground and asked me to leave the house. Can't get my call Is it the, 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 the embarrassment? Is it the name calling? Is it the insults? Do you know what I went through? Do you know the psychological effects what he did uh, made me go through? Eh? Do you know what his stupid action? Do you know the how he impacted my mental health? Ha! I don't know easy like that. Too. It's not as easy as that. Too. It's not that easy. That was a mistake on his own. Having married you for 15 years, you should have known what you can do and what you cannot do. Ah, Biko Butsu. Wow. Why does he want my forgiveness? Hmm. My brother wants you back. Yes. He said that the children are threatening to take him to social welfare if he fails to bring you back to the house. Akama say. Because he ain't in a command idea. Akama say. So because he is afraid that my children might report him. That is why he wants my forgiveness. Mban. If run a condition at the So it will not work. Why your mama? That is not how to ask for forgiveness. Why Biko. Um, Jeanette, my in-law, you see, I blame your brother for his premeditated actions towards my sister. It cost us a lot in this household. A lot! Hmm. He's regretting every bit of that action of his. He asked me to be his forerunner. Hey. Do you know how many times I've visited him in the city to discuss his um, issues with my sister? And one time he asked the gate man never to let me in again. Hmm. A whole me. See insult. <laughs> eh? Who knows the dead native doctor he went to consult that told him that I wanted to kill him. And he believed the, the useless person. Who climbed and sink? Kill him. A man that you have four boys for. Uh -huh. For what? Maybe in his mind now, he thinks I want to kill him so that I can inherit his wealth. And then use it to make my only brother here very wealthy. <laughs> <laughs> Who cares about his world? Uh, my in law, the thing there is tell him that any day he is ready and willing to reconcile with his wife, he can come. I will not stop him. Who am I? Eh? I will not. Thank you so much, my in law. You're Thank welcome. you so much, Ogum. Right. Thank you so much. The ball is now in your court. So, can you move in? Court, Tony. Whose court? Eh, Janet, don't push it to my court. In Amir, the ball is in your brother's court. Even though I need small time to, to, to wrap my head around the insult and the disgrace he, he purposely gave me. It's okay, my wife. Take your time, I beg you. Yeah? Just take your time, Wanya, Mama. Thank you so much. Ah, uh, Joyce. I need your help. I am missing peace, seriously. If I don't even know where to find her now. Oh, Peter, Peter, just stop. Frankly, stop visiting my house. Please. 
My fiancé is complaining bitterly. Ah, well, I'm sorry about that. But your fiancé should as well know that we don't have anything in common. We are just friends. Peter, please, stop this visit. Because I don't want to lose my husband to be. You can go and look for peace and settle whatever thing you have with her. How can I settle with her when she doesn't take my course? And she's nowhere to be found. That's why I ask for your help. If I can find her, I, 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 I will amend my ways, please. Peter, you know I warned you against your decision. Didn't I? Yes, you did. So. And I see that as a youthful madness. And I'm really sorry, I'm regretting my actions. This thing is becoming something else. Peter, please, you can go to her house and set with anything you have with her. Cut me out! <sighs> Joycey! My sister, life is no bed of roses. If your husband realizes himself and decides to come and apologize, what is there? You just forgive him now. Oh dear, that one that I know, that one will never change you. Leave that thing, all this Mago Mago is doing. He, he, somebody is forcing him. In fact, he's doing it because of the pressure from the kids. Me, I'm in constant communication with my first son, so I know what is going on. Although he acted on my assumption of hearsay and does that, does that make him a normal man? Hmm. Does that make him a normal man? A man who's so worldly like that and highly placed in society. Why would he act based on my assumptions? Not even that the assumption makes break. The assumption is even senseless. Why would I want to kill my husband? I don't even understand. Eh? A man I married out of love, oh. When he did not have shishi, we couldn't even eat well. We struggled. Eh? What kind of senseless assumption is that? He shouldn't even entertain it, talk more of act on it. I'm sure, sister, I support you. I support what you. What are you saying? Eh? No, no, no. Auntie Maki, I know he did not do well. But please. Prepare your mind to forgive him if he comes. Ah, I just hope my heart will agree. Even if my one heart wants to agree, heart, there are turbulent waters that he must pass through before I even listen to him. Sister, I support you. As a matter of fact, if he comes back, he will have to take an oath to avoid um, this thing happening again now. Oh. Leave, leave me alone. It's true, Biko. You don't know what that man did to me. Do you know that when I met this man, I know who knew We were sleeping on mat, and even, then he made he made money, and I wanted to kill. We even have it's bed temptation, inside. Temptation. Oh, man. Kiru, sit down there. Kiru, give me two. I don't want my whole police. Kiru, please don't misunderstand me. Who is that young man that just visited now? Who is he? Oh, <laughs> is it that one? Well, he's a visitor. Mm, he said he's looking for peace and he said his name is Peter. So, for peace, I'm not really near. Peace is not. She's not. Her Doesn't wife. he have peace number or her whereabouts? Like he told me that he has been calling uh, peace, but she's avoiding his calls. So, I don't know. Juro. That young man is invading my privacy. And I've started suspecting both of you. How do you mean? Eh? No, 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 I'm going to get you. How do you mean? Don't understand. Kiro. Hmm. Kiro. Please, there is nothing wrong for you directing him where he will find peace. Uh, because I, I was thinking directing him to Aham's uh, 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 house uh, may cause a bad impression. Eh? What, so, what useless impression are you talking about? Tell warn him never to visit me at wee hours. It is what I said. He should stop coming here. He should go and look wherever peace is and stop invading my privacy. I say it again. Oh, I feel you. I can see that you, you have started growing with again. Your children must know about this. 
Every time young man will pack here, say his name is Peter or put the what can what, what can what, stop it all. <laughs> Let me meet her. <laughs> Not only someone, I invoked you. <laughs> eh? Were you not the one that told me you, uh, you had something you want us to discuss? Now you're saying I summoned you. Abi Akudo's love has um, suddenly scattered your brain. Sister, you're not far from the truth. Though. Hey, hey! That girl's love has eaten me up. My, I'm scattered. <laughs> <laughs> naughty, 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 naughty. <laughs> but it's okay. So, what um what do you want? Okay, you you know we'll be going to the hospital tomorrow because we have an appointment with the doctor. I I came to see if you can give me some money, you know, to do some little buying, some stopping and buying, you know, me gala. Mm. Gala and cook and the rest of them. You know, um taxi that we use and then um, Hospital oh, bills and the rest of them. Girl. How much do you need? Uh, at least 100,000 or 150,000 will cover the bill. Okay. I will give you 200,000 for your pocket money. Hey. Forget about your wife. I will take her to the hospital myself. You know, this is woman issue and when your money I will see never. You know, I've given birth to four, so I know this things. I will handle it, don't worry. Sister Wakego. Cash, mm. madam. <laughs> Sister, thank you very much. Eh? God bless you. God bless you for me, please. God bless you. Mm. Let me go and um, start getting ready. Okay, don't worry, I have your account number. So I'm going to transfer the money to you. I, are you sure it's still my account yeah, number? It is still here. Yeah. There's no point deleting it now. Because if I do, you will, you will still send more. Ah, yeah, yeah, nice. So, no, so you didn't delete it all those times. No, you were quoted. Don't worry, I'll transfer the money to you. Uh, thank you very much, sister. Uh, I don't know what's wrong with this game. Though. So, like I was saying, I I will just pretend I would um, re-establish in this country, and then, boom. I mean, I'm already tired of this country. I'm wrong with my wife. I'm telling you. Hey, my in-law. Hey, okay, so this is what you're saying. So you want to run away with my sister and you will just dump me here. <laughs> and who told you we're leaving without you? Hey, you just said it now. Hey, you've been busy saying all your plans. How you're going to run away with my sister and everything. You didn't even put me in any of the plans now. Hey, did I hear my name, please, dear? My in-law, there is no way we're leaving without you. Do you know what you mean to us? I mean, your sister and I. Huh? Eh? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, tell me. <laughs> you mean the world to us. Aww. Especially your sister. <laughs> now, let me tell you a secret. Do you know your sister will die if you're not close to her? <laughs> I don't know, she just loves you so much. I love her I've too. never seen that kind of love before. <laughs> I love her too, and she knows. <laughs> I can't leave or stay without her. Uh, Una, good morning. Um, yes, good morning, young man. I... I don't think we've met before. Have we? Actually, you have not met. Uh, my name is uh, Peter. I'm from Obisi community. Oh. And I came to see PC. She's my girlfriend. Who is your girlfriend? Eh? Did I hear you well? Who is your girlfriend? I ask you, Peter. How many times have I told you to stay away from me? I made it very clear. It is over between us. Didn't you get it? 
What the hell are you doing here? Wait, oh, by the way, who told you I'm here? How did you find him? Wait, you've been going up and down looking for me, Okwaya? What for? Please, please, just, just calm down. Calm down. Eh? This young man is here to see you. If you two have a problem, you sit down and talk about it and I'm sure My there's nothing Lord, I can There is nothing to talk about with Peter. There is nothing to talk about with him. It is over between us. Get it. Nonsense. Then call him. Please. Please have every reason to be angry with me because I hurt her so bad. And I came here to make my maid me. Like I said before, I have never seen peace that mad. I've never seen her that angry. So what transpired between you two that made her this angry? It was pride that came over me. Because there is a nasty condition I gave to her that before our relationship can work out, she must accept to get pregnant for me first. Yeah. Get pregnant for you first. And why would you give her such condition if you truly love her like you claim? I was thinking that uh, there are plenty of ladies outside there. But you know, uh, when it comes to wife material, just like uh, breaking a rock with a wood. And I must say that peace is a wife material after I realized my mistake. No, she's not a wife material. There are plenty uh, of women out there. You can go to those joints and pick one and get married to her. And I'm yeah? ready to say sorry, sir. I'm ready to make this my wife if she accepts one. Take me back. I want you to talk to her. Listen, possible. listen, I will talk to her. I will try my best, all right? But you have to be very careful. Because this is the first and last time I'm doing this. All right? Oh, I will, sir. I will, sir. If you have me to talk to her, God will bless you. And I will be ready to perform the marriage right immediately before another guy will come and smash half away from me. Give me some time now. I'll Thank try. you very much. God bless you, sir. I'll try. My in-law, I'll advise you to find a place in your heart to forgive that young man. Yes. The man I saw have got prospect and he has plans for the future. Which future? See, my in-law, Gomuke, I am sorry, oh. But Peter should go to hell. He should go and look for another woman. A woman who will be willing to get pregnant before marriage. Because I, Peace, I am not interested. My own problem is to know if the young man is handsome or not. Because I don't want an ugly man as an in-law. No, this one, Amaka. Mm. Yes, the man is very beautiful. So you're not, you're not even serious. And we're here talking something serious. And you're here talking about handsome. Ha. Yes, sir. Ha. You're Look at my uh, What are you saying? You need a handsome man now. Eh? You want to come away? Listen, I don't want an ugly man to touch my sister, not to talk of impregnating her. Bam, bam, bam. I don't want that one. Pico. You're right. Me, I'm not even ready to even settle with the Peter self. Eh, I'm not. Ah. She's not very selective, sissy. You should know that. That's why you're my sister. <laughs> hey, you know what's up? It is better to marry a handsome, loving, understanding, caring, good in you know, <laughs> poor man. Someone like this, my you know, and then walking, eh? I for him, I for gonna give me. No, no, you no. know this one with this one with me, eh? I don't need lamp in my house at night. <laughs> I, I, I don't understand. Not living with an apple. No, 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 wait, I don't, I don't understand. What do you mean by that? I, so you're, you're, you're indirectly calling me a poor man. Now. But no, uh, uh, my love. Oh, Sam. Ah, the richest man in the world. That's why I married you now. Sister, you pussy, what about bamboo? Get in a zoo. Eh? Living in the zoo. That's <laughs> it. But on the contrary, my love, like my mother will always say, 
The beauty of a man is actually his bank account and not his physical appearance. Because a rich, ugly babu in the zoo, Zazuze, can marry any anybody, even the finest girl in the world. So what I are see. you not saying? Mm -mm. No, 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 no. You see this thing you just said? There is exception to that. What are you saying? You want me to wake up in the night, middle of the night, start running, thinking that a ghost visited me because I married a zoo. <laughs> bam, 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 bam. Listen, you see my sister and I, we have a thing for handsome men. I'm okay, JJ meeting. A man that when you come out, all eyes on me. <laughs> like uh, the guy that came to see her, bitch. Eh? Handsome guy. Are you serious? <laughs> no, it's alright. Keke, I'm going to be handsome. Eh? Which handsome? Sister, you know now. Open up for okay, me make her for. So I'm just guy managing him. Is there any handsome man? <laughs> my love. Eh? No. Guy, I'm a guy. <laughs> now, oh, okay. oh, yeah. I'm very, very, very happy. Uh, uh, Imagine the twist of events that happens in Aham's family. Can you imagine that? That shows that our ancestors are not asleep. Hey. If I tell you that I am not both happy and surprised, I should be a liar. Now, DK. See it. On that fateful day before the book of peace between Ahamefula and Wakego, before my very eyes, Ahamefula knelt down, pleading to Wakego, but Wakego refused to accept his apologies. He used to accept the younger brother's apology. Yes, or is Yoko The only brother. Yes, she refused. Wakego. That means that something associated or motivated Wakego's sudden change. Ah, well. Nadike, whatever has motivated that, I thank our ancestors because Wakego has changed. Mm. Yes, mm. there's a great change in her. And uh, Nadike, there's one more thing. Please, look deep into Akudo's childlessness. Mm. Because Uku Kaiji Acho, Ihi Daramere. For mother, Uku Kaiji Acho has her money. And you don't think that I am a kid. I'm an adult. And you don't tell an adult, go out of the sun. No, now. Nadike! <laughs> <laughs> huh? In my only two, I know what I'm doing. Nadike! Hmm? You are truly the son of the sun. Just like you are. <laughs> yeah. Where are you? Ogada. Hmm? Ogada. Ogada. Ijadi. Ufa mother, Ijadi. Nadike! Hey! Yeah, what do we? Hey! After listening to a lot of complaints from uh, Peter, eh? with loads and loads of oaths of allegiance, well, I decided to call uh, Peace and I asked Peace to forgive him. I even gave her permission to escort him so that, you know, on the way they can talk and try and see how they can patch things, you know? So, Sister, I don't blame the people that said love is wicked. Because for the first time in a long time, that young man is going to have peace of mind. Mm. Eh? <laughs> Honestly, mm. I thank God that he did not have an accident while coming to this house every day. Auntie, this guy comes to this house every day begging, pleading, asking for peace. Eh, but that's not seem right. That's not seem right. Get all your amulakon. Eh? Now he will treat peace like the priceless ornament that she is. Ah, uh -uh. you know sometimes men need to be treated that way, eh? Because they always like to to, to learn the hard way. No, no, uh -huh. no, 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 sister. Sister, I make fear. I don't agree with you, sister. Some men are loving, compassionate, passionate, treat their women nicely. Men like me. No. My wife can attest to that now. So what are you saying? Yes, you. He's right, so. What's wrong again? Look at that. Lotion. So this one is said there. I agree with him. It's true. Yeah. Oh, when you have to open your eyes, you'll have But uh, in all sincerity, if you peace one on one, <laughs> peace has a very strong heart. Right. She hardly forgets, so. <laughs> she hardly forgives, so. So I pray she listens to your advice. You know I like that kind of art. 
Hmm? I like people with that kind of heart. In fact, I wish God would give me that kind of strong heart so that I will use it and deal with that my influential husband. Ah, God forbid. Ah, God forbid. Ah, ah, what are you saying? Chairman that normally calls me, hey, how far am I guy? Okay, because we now I got you get a CBO, send them account. Bogum. Send them account. Bogum. All listening? of a sudden, you just cut off the whole thing. Sister, I pray God will soften your heart so that you can go back to your husband now. Ah. Uh -huh. ah, you, you just just you just scattered everything with your I don't know. And you're telling me how, your heart is even worse than that of peace. You don't know? No, me, I'm planning to forgive him more. Uh, but he has to tumble from that gate and roll on his head inside his place <laughs> and beg me well before I will accept. Are you saying you're not wicked? <laughs> <laughs> you're very wicked. See, eh? Uh, see, Joy. Mm -hmm. If not that we are in Lent period, if not that, eh? Uh, I go to church to take Holy Communion, not only in so, I will never talk to you. You're a very wicked friend. Two-faced woman being, that is who you are. And this is how friends of these days, that's how they are. They can never keep secrets. Never! It's Wicked friend. How could you make such decision? Why won't I make such decision? Why won't I make such decision to stay away from evil friend like you? Eh? How could you? Joy, how could you? After everything, you went to go and tell Peter where I'm staying. Why will you tell Peter where I'm staying? Me. Why? Me, Joy. Mm -mm, me. Omo. Omo didn't know. Omo. Omo. Was he the person that said that to you? Mm, but he wasn't. He was me that said it. Was he? Ha. Please, please, please. This joke is expensive. I don't like this. Please. It's expensive, Okoya. Is no. it after your warnings? Why will I do such a thing? Why won't you do it when you've already done Wait, it? Wait, too. Have you forgotten that uh, he do visit your uncle and the wife as well? Have you? Me too. Yes. You're right. That means Auntie Q must have told him. Hey! I should have thought about it. Oh, you're yeah, sorry. Eh? Is that why your 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 frowning is your ugly face? Hmm. Eh? Hmm. I know that I'm ugly, but Amy, my sweetheart, loves me. How about you, Billy? Hey, you're getting off your. I'm going back here. Hmm. Oh, get on now. Baby, not too well. Hey. No, but you want to see though. Please, by the way, how did you go? Hmm. My dear. Everything is just there. For now, it's under probation. Mm. Till I'm ready to make up my mind that I want him. No, he should not come and stress me when he was busy giving me conditions left and right. He does not know. Now he want me to call No, you wait. He will suffer small. He will not just come back like that. Oh, you could have told me that yeah, you are looking for a repentant. Uh... <clears throat> Repentant words. Unyashere. Mba. Cho 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 cho. Biya kai no no sewa. Unyala. Sister. One two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five. Sister, this is the money Peter gave me. Yes, yeah, so really? he said that uh, I should go and buy my cream, I should go and buy my eye pencil, mm -hmm. I should go and buy my what? lipstick, I should buy everything that I want to. That he liked the way I'm looking. Hey. <laughs> so, sister, Mba, tell me, how much do you want? Nego, <laughs> Ipa. Eh. One them because give me the one that comes out of your mind. Eh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Okay. Mba, sister, thank you. Twelve thousand. <laughs> no way, Bannon. One them. There is no way we share your money equally. Hey, Gogi. Sister, this is twelve, and this is thirteen. You see? Oh yeah, take this one. After all, this money is not to be compared to what you spend on me. So why are you bothered? You give me money if I don't have money to give my 
<laughs> you give me money if I don't have money to buy cream. I'm going to take it. <laughs> Please. Peace. Mm? Hey. Thank you so much, my blood. <laughs> you are more than a sister to me. Eh. Honestly. If I'm more than a sister to you, it means that I'm your mommy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Sister, call me mommy. <laughs> but just the part, that is what you are to me. My mother. Uh, Mama Akudo. Yes. Apom Mula Akudo. Oh, Nemo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, sister, you don't give me. I swear. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You don't know what you've just done. 12,000 naira. No okay, Hey. Sister, Nemo. I'm only praying for you that God will bless you with a child. I can't wait for you to carry your own baby and breastfeed them. Amen. Amen. You see, eh? Mm -hmm. That very day that I will breastfeed my own child, I will offer a sacrifice of burnt offering because I will be filled with joy. It will happen. My happiness will know no bound. It will happen and it will surely happen. Amen. I'm already God expecting it. It's a miracle of God. A great one. He doesn't fail. I know, right? I know. <laughs> I believe him. I know. Uh, yeah. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. You. So tell me. Yeah. Hope you and Peter have come back together. No. Um, he's on one month uh, probation. Oh, so okay. till I make up my mind. I want to come back. <laughs> One month to gain it. Probation. Peace. Mm -hmm. After collecting his 25,000 naira. Mm. 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 <laughs> but he's a nice person now. Give him a chance. Peace. I find you peace, but you are a troublemaker. I will let it out. The blood flow continued last night. Chimo. Eh? It flowed throughout the night. And you're saying it so calmly. Don't you know what is happening? You're losing the baby now. And you don't have anybody else to blame but yourself. Hey! You will start going to the hospital. Now, 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 now. Keta, Keta! Okay, I'll go to the hospital. But I want to ask you, what of those pregnant women who engage in vigorous activities like farming? I will see some heavy pregnant women who hug, engage in hard levels, yet give birth without stress. Akudo, different women with different body systems. Eh? That is the same reason it will be difficult for one woman to take him and very easy for another woman to take him. Besides, jumping that Okada and going to the market was not what the doctor told you. In fact, the doctor specifically told you to rest over here. Uh -huh. I'm sorry. The thing is that I thought that the distance from here to the market is short. It's so yoko. Asonya mami here. Asonya mami here, ka doctor. You are you are you know better than the doctor. That doctor that asked you to take bed rest, you know better than him, okay? Meanwhile, where was uh, uh, that piece when you you, you, you jumped at Okada? Where was she? She was around when I left. She asked me not to go to the market. Is your for no no? Is your for no akuya? Don't stay in that zone like a prisoner. In fact, you see this sitting down there. You are sitting down talking calmly. Do me some my boy. Get up now. Go and prepare. And be fast about it. Let me make arrangements for transportation. Oh, say so, say so. Ah ah. Hey. Fast, fast. It's no I 
happy as yet today. Yes, I had a nice time. <laughs> you know I can do everything just to make you happy. You know that's why I love you. I love you so much. Stop, Joe. What do you mean? Won't you come inside to greet my people? Why not? Alright. Let's go in there. <laughs> yeah, move. Stop looking at my bomb bomb. Which bomb bomb? <laughs> come on, move. My in-law. Like I said earlier, my sister here is ready to go back to her husband's house. As a matter of fact, her bags are already packed. But the thing there is that um, your brother, her husband, needs to come here to explain to our king's men, very simple, just like tradition demands, what my sister did that made him throw her out of the house. Mm -hmm. Yes. He has to come and state my offense. That offense that I committed that made him throw me out of our peaceful matrimonial home and, and, and embarrassed me publicly. Ogum, I have made for I beg you. Hmm? Is it both Ogum? I beg you, people. That is the part of the request my brother needs help with. He said that he's ashamed of himself and cannot face the human now. Bikon. Oh? Jared, the Alawa. Start going. I can see that you people are not serious at all. When you people are serious to take me back, we will know. In Anokwa, he's suddenly ashamed of himself. Can you imagine that? I don't understand that statement. Ah. Because saying that he's ashamed of clearing the air is as good as a case of accusing someone in the fullness of the market and then when the market is empty you now uh, withdraw your accusation that's not correct now. thank you my brother thank oh, you nice. so how then will the people that have gone home from the market know that the the person was accused wrongly yeah my mm. love you mom you put her you put her right but is there no way we can buy cut the old money and do the internal settlement? Kaimeya settlement. My in-law, there is no way we can buy cut anything. Because we need to prove to our king's men and people of our community that my sister here is innocent. Innocent of being a killer. Don't forget that part. Don't forget that what they accuse me of is killing. Killing, being a murderer. Mama. Do you know what that accusation has cost me? Do you know that I no longer walk on the, the, uh, 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 on the streets of this village? Do you know that I don't even go to the market because of shame? Ah, Mbakwa, he needs to come and clear my name publicly. My wife, I have you guys. Let me get home. I will get back to you guys. Oh, darling, oh. Who your mom? Uh, so I could. Uh, cool. Once more, you're welcome to your family of origin. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, uh, um, cool. So I'm now a visitor to be welcomed. Yes, so. <laughs> uh, don't you know? Huh? Do you know that if anything good or bad should happen to you now that you are here, mm. I own serious explanation. Do I have a It's true. I, I think. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, um, there are this that day that said that um, it is only a fool that does not know that his brother is a stranger in the house. So, what brought you here? Uncle, it's about this young man here, Peter. He indicated interest in marrying my younger sister, Peace. Yes, Uncle. I truly love Peace and I would like to settle down with her. And that's why we're here. <laughs> you see the way he said it? Settle. <laughs> settle. Settle. Uh, okay, uh, no, why, why would I? <laughs> uh, and uh, as tradition demands, uh, I brought this for you. Mm. So, you him. Oh, oh, Omega. <laughs> well, um, you say your name is Peter. Yes, sir. Mm. I accept this drink with thanks. Right. But you nearly caused trouble. And problem in this family. Ha. Uh -huh. 
Are you not the same young man from Obis that frequent here all the time? You drive in, you drive out, you drive in, you drive out. You said that you are you, you were looking for peace or something. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. That was the one. Mm -hmm. My dear, you nearly cut me my marriage. Oh. My husband here accused me of infidelity. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> nearly. Oh. Hey, it's not for God. Do you know what? Oh, mm. At the time I was thinking, who is this young man oh. who wants to snatch? Because oh, the the <laughs> How can you accuse an as, oh. oh. as I'm getting older, mm -hmm. you know women like it younger. Ah. <laughs> 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 so, uh, Peter, you're welcome. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, this case of um, Peter and um, Peace has finally proven that your love theory is correct. So, you know, because who would have believed that Peace would accept them? Um, chairman back. <laughs> Why won't she? Why won't she? Even me that is talking here, I will not guarantee you that I will not fall into, mm -mm, not even fall, I will not somersault into my husband's arms if he dares walk into this compound now. I'm gonna aguado. Wait, sister, don't tell me. I hope you're not joking, you know. <laughs> I, I hope this is not a joke because I can't wait to start receiving my magic alert again. Oh, so magic alert. No, 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 no. Chairman, how far? Keep what? <laughs> Send your account. <laughs> <laughs> Keep <laughs> uh, uh. Hey, but Don't you know that the heart grows fonder with absence? Mm. Uh -huh, now, unless there's no love in your relationship, oh, as long as there is love, an atom of love, eh? Yeah. Once you people see each other again, that chemistry must come to play before you know what is happening. Yeah, then you're gonna care. People are starting hugging, kissing. Ah, see you. I think I need to start um, always get my jota whenever you're talking about love. Auntie Wakego, what happened? What happened when? Were you not the one that said the other day? That if your husband comes to plead with you, that he has to somersault from the gate before you forgive him. Oh, no. Forget what someone said in anger, because <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, let me shock you well. <laughs> well, Abo, stop picking, Bano. Confirm this for us. Who is going to What am I confirming? What do I know about love? I'm just learning. I'm going to start now for now. Be our love doctor here. Oh. Eh, Auntie Waka, because it's so much to us, I'm enjoying it. The most <laughs> important thing here is that you have accepted your husband. Yes, sir. You know, your future husband. Exactly. Uh, so, congratulations. Oh. Oh. Don't worry. You will see that marriage is a very sweet institution. Get that for one man. Can't you see how they are enjoying That is the same way you will enjoy your husband. <laughs> there's love there. There's no, there true is love. love. There is true love. I can see it in her eyes. Even though she's trying to cover the eyes, I can see the pain at her love. My love. I'm not even a man. Jack, I can't live with you. From Auntie Mwakego's statement earlier, can't you put one and one together to know that she wants to go back to her family? Yes, yes, I know. I know she wants to. Okay. And I'm not holding her back. But forget jokes, so all those things I was saying there. Uh, chairman, how far? I send your account. Boom. Money enter. No matter how much you put in my account, every traditional right must be met before my sister goes back to his house. It's, it's tradition now. Tradition is tradition. You don't play with it. Baby, what do you have to gain keeping her here? Don't you know that her going back to her family will facilitate the help she promised us? Facilitate help mm -hmm. she promised us? Mm -hmm. How? I don't understand. Explain. If she joins her family, uh -huh. the help she promised us will be double with the help of her husband. Mm -hmm. If she had a mind to give you one million and her husband adds another one million, that makes it two million. Hello. This is. Ah. This is ideal. Mm -hmm. 
No, 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 no. Your, 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 your idea is. I, I'm impressed, though. Ha! I'm impressed. You know what? I will talk to my uncle about this. You know? We'll make plans and see if we can settle this internally because this is what the husband actually wants. And if you succeed in talking your uncle into this, her husband will value you more. He will see it as a huge favor that you've done for him and he will appreciate you. Idea. Mm -hmm. Idea! If I help him, he will help me. Wow. If I scratch his back, he will scratch my back. Mm -hmm. And then he will ask for my account and boy, plenty money. Yes, sir. We travel abroad and we enjoy. Start living a good life. <laughs> <laughs> that is why I married you. And, and you, you, you have sense. Mm. Too much sense. You can say that again. Hey, no, 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 no. You're too smart. I need our unborn children to live a good life. I don't want them to suffer here in the village. Where's the water you asked for? I don't know what. You have to try. Yeah? Your temperature is very high. This is a sign of typhoid and malaria. You have to try. Take your bath, eat, and take the drugs my husband bought for you. Oh? I don't have to try. You have to try. You go. Hikon, you have to try. Yeah, I know. Yeah? Please, you have to try and eat. So you take the drugs. Yeah, stand up so you drink the water. Stand up so you drink the water. I will have some food. My love, I think you should go in there. Eh? Try to force her now to take the medicine I got for her. She's your younger sister. She needs to take those medicines at, at least so she gets better before we take her to the hospital. What are you saying? Takudo should go inside and force a grown woman to take her medicine. Here! Let us go outside and chatter a taxi. I am Mabuli Eko Ozuma that don't bring you any taxi. We bundle her inside the taxi and take her straight to the hospital. I'm a little bit of Auntie Wakego, don't you think it will be too, too risky taking her to the hospital in her condition without giving her first aid? Consider the distance. Which still falls back to my suggestion. Eh? Go in there, she's your younger sister. Find a way to talk to her. Convince her to take the medicine so she can get, gather strength before we take her to the hospital. Eh? As simple as ABC. <laughs> Let me go and see what I can do. Please go and see it. what you can do. Go and, go and do something, please. please. Eh? Are, you? Are you sure that this is not a manji? Yeah. Which one is Obanji again now? Uh -huh. Considering the sudden way that sickness just came, pia, no announcement, nothing. Eh? What do you want me to say? That can only be a serious attack, and serious attacks like that can only come from demons. No, I, I, I don't understand, though, sister. So before sickness will come to someone, there will, there will be a special announcement. Hey, 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 special announcement, malaria is coming. Special announcement, you see your wife is coming. Ha! Now, wow. Or maybe they will send SMS or send you, uh, uh, put a call through. No. This girl is not feeling fine. Now, let's find a way to save her life. You're saying all these things you're saying. <laughs> I don't even understand you. Yeah. Hello. My sister, why are you refusing to take your drugs? I will be fine. Yes, I'm fine. All I need right now is bed rest. That's all I need. All you need is bed rest. So we should just allow you to rest. 
Can't you see that the entire family is worried about your sudden sickness? How do you expect us to relax and watch you die? Please. I will not die. I will live and testify the goodness of Lord in my life. Don't worry yourself, sister. You worry so much. What will happen to me? I'll be fine. Okay, fine. If you are sure of what you just said, that you are fine. Can I get your food now? I don't want to eat, can't you see? I don't want to eat food, I'm not hungry. Please, why are you doing this to me? Why are you doing this? Even Sister Mwakego suggested that we rush you to City Hospital. But well, how will you be treated since you've not had anything to eat? You need to eat to be treated. I'm not going to any City Hospital. And nothing is wrong with me. I'm fine. Why is it that you like crying? You like crying. Now you're making me to cry. Just leave me. I'm okay. I'll be fine. Leave me alone. Frankly, I am tired of this whole situation. You know, I was thinking. I was thinking that you would pity me. That you will think of my own health condition and have mercy on me. But no, you are making it worse for me. You are making everything worse for me by refusing all effort to make you well again. What would you have me do, please? What do you want me to do? I'm fine. I'm okay. Just let me be. Don't worry yourself about me. I'm okay. I'll be fine. It's what you are doing is not fair. You know you are the only family I have. You know that this your sickness is affecting me too. Now you are not the only person sick. I am sick too. Bikonu, is Bikonu, Bikozeno. What are you doing here? Why are you crying? Why would I cry? Why would I cry? Can't you see that my sister is dying in silence? Okay. Should something happen to her? What will I tell my uncle? Stop. Alright. <laughs> Nothing is going to happen to your sister. She'll be fine. Stop this thing you're doing now. Stop it. Ham. You are talking as if you don't know she is the only one I have. No other brother. No sister. No father. No mother. She is all I've got in this world. At the same time, you cannot force her to take her medicines. Neither can you force her to go to the hospital. <sighs> eh? She knows her body system more than any one of us. So I'm very sure she's fine. So stop all this. Stop it, please. At this point, I am confused. I don't know anything anymore. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to think. I just don't know. I don't know. I know. You should try and put yourself together. Remember the doctor's warning. Who cares about the doctor's warnings? Who cares? If I am 100% okay and my sister is not feeling fine, my sister is dying. Does that make any sense? Can you stop the scene you're saying? Your sister is not dying. And what do you mean she's dying in silence? Stop the scene you're saying. Let's go inside, please. Your sister is not dying now. Stop pro uh, proclaiming evil. Please, let's, let's... please, 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 just... Babe, I said let's go inside. Eh? Your sister is fine. Peace is fine. My sister-in-law is fine. 
Nothing is going to happen to her. My sister is dying. My sister is dying. And she doesn't want to take any medicine. She doesn't know what to go to the hospital. My sister is just dying in silence. Nobody knows what is happening to her. Can you stop this negativity? Just stop, please. Your sister is not dying. Let's go inside. Peace, my darling. Why don't you agree and go to the hospital? Do you know the psychological trauma this your sickness is giving your sister? Do you know? Auntie Maka, I don't want to go to any hospital, see any doctor. Okay, so should we agree or assume that you already know what is wrong with you? No, it's just that, you know, uh, these days I've just been chewing up. Eh? The smell of food disgusts me. That's how I've just been so uncomfortable. You see, that is the main reason you should go to a proper hospital and conduct a proper test. Eh? Wait, let me ask you, when was the last time you treated malaria? It's been a while, but the symptoms I'm feeling, I don't know if it's malaria or because the way that I'm just showing up, my tummy, sometimes it should just be turning, and my breast is feeling me, it's very Please. heavy. Please, I will like you to see me as your blood auntie. Just relax, be comfortable and confide in me, okay? Have you seen your flu this month? No. Or maybe these are symptoms that indicate that it's on its way. I can't tell, honestly. This one is strange, oh. or maybe this is the new trend. I, I can't tell. Well, the symptoms vary as we get older, so we never can tell. The bitter truth is that peace might be pregnant. Pregnant? How? Where? When? For who? My love, my love, calm down. Calm down. Eh? Let's take things one step at a time. Okay? Ah. Sister Wakego, are you sure about this? How did you find out now? I was talking with her, trying to see if I can get any kind of information out of her. The next thing she started vomiting. And I had to attend to her myself. Hey! 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 My only sister pregnant. Hey! I can't take it I will advise you to handle this with kids glove. Because honestly, I am not sure. I am just, you know, speaking out of experience. My love. Hmm? My sister is right. Okay? I don't want you pushing her and other words making her withhold information. Hey. Take things easy so she doesn't do otherwise. Huh? Hey. Hey. Baby, do you know the stigma, the shame, the insults, the disgrace, the rejection that this could bring to this family if, if it happens to be true? Um, I would not want you to go against my words. Go inside there, talk to your sister and see if she will open up to you. Go now! Go and talk to her. Go and talk to her and see if she'll tell you anything, okay? Go, 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 go. Go and talk to her.
you know that wherever our late parents are wherever they are watching us from right now they will be so happy of how united we are mm. you know right sister you know I, I don't believe in all those things I don't believe that our loved ones are watching us from somewhere I just feel they are all assumption. Yes. But it's you now, you believe what you believe. To me, the dead are alive spiritually. And it is a generally accepted theory that the spiritual controls the physical. Hmm. Sister, please. Leave all these spiritual, spiritual something. Why did you bring me out? You know my health condition. I can't stay like this for long. I want to go and lie down. I'm sorry I stressed you out here. Yeah. Mm. I brought you out to ascertain what exactly is wrong with you. Tell me your sister the truth. What is wrong with you? How many times did I tell you that something is wrong with me? How many times did I make it known to all of you that I'm okay? Why are you people bugging me and trying to bring out words from my mouth? Why all the noise? The noise is because we care for and love you. Secondly, you have totally refused. You have refused going to the hospital for a proper checkup. So I'm a child, right? I'm a baby that cannot take care of myself, right? That is why everybody is trying to bring out words from my mouth. I've told you for countless times, nothing is wrong with me. I am fine. I am fine. So. <coughs> Peace, my beloved sister, my one and only sister in whom I am well pleased. I am this worried because if anything bad is to happen to you, I will take my life. Yes. I will kill myself so that our father's lineage be closed. I can't live. I cannot live, not even for a second, without you. Can you listen to yourself? No. You want to kill yourself if anything happens to me. Oh my God. Akudo. From what planet are you from? Yes, we are sisters. But our destinies are different. We have different destinies. You saying you will take your own life if anything happens to me. No, it's a no-no. You have your life, I have my life. And I want you to know that nothing will happen to me. Then should I take it that nothing serious is wrong with you? She's not dying, all right? Your sister is not dying. Besides, she's not even helping matters. 
she's not dying. Stop stressing yourself. Can't you see? Can't you see how broken I am? Can you not see the trouble I am passing through? What I don't understand is why this is being this hard on me. Does she want me to kill myself? Does she want me to commit suicide before she realizes that I am not physically, emotionally and mentally okay? Stop I'm losing it. Stop, 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 stop. Stop. What do you mean by peace wants to make you commit suicide? What was the meaning of that thing now? Please don't say that thing you're saying. Please don't say it again. Peace is not a child. Eh? She's not a child. She understands her own body more than any one of us. Stop stressing yourself for your own good, I'm telling you. Stop stressing yourself. I should stop stressing myself. Yes, stop she, stressing yourself. Do you know why you are saying this? It is because she is not your blood sister. Yes, because she is not your blood sister. I should not I, I should stop stressing myself because of one, one doctor's advice. I should let my blood sister die. The only person I have. I should just let her die. Sorry, I didn't say she let her die. Eh? I, I didn't say she let her die. She's not going to die. That you are just disturbing yourself too much. Peace. And... Okay. You say you want to run mad. I am disturbing myself. Run mad, but I'm back out. That you change then. I am. I am disturbing myself. Baby, stop this thing you're doing now. You you want me just to, crying up and down. You, you, you want me. You want me to allow my sister to die. Would that be so callous and inconsiderate of me? What are you telling me? I am just going mad. I don't know what to do again. I don't know what to do. I'm losing my senses. Please wants to kill me. Please wants to finish me. Baby, don't lose your don't lose your senses, so. hmm. Please wants to finish me. Don't, don't, this is not don't, fair. Don't lose your senses, so. I, I, I know why I'm saying this thing. Don't don't do this thing and lose your senses, so. <sighs> Joyce, thank you so much. Thank you for honoring my invitation. Yeah. Although I have to suspend all I'm doing at home to make it here. So, what's the meaning of the urgent song? I'm sorry for any inconvenience I must have caused you. I am deeply sorry. Forgive me. The thing is that I called you here because of an urgent matter. It is a big problem. And this problem has to do with my sister who is also your bosom friend. Peace. What about her? She's seriously sick. She is very sick. The problem here now is that she has refused to go to the hospital. She has also refused to take the drugs that my husband bought for her. The thing is driving me crazy. Why? That's why I called you. Being her friend, she might be able to open up to you and tell you what the problem is. So I want you to talk to her and know, and know what the problem is. Please, I have talked and talked. I have cried. I don't know what else Please, to where do. Is she? She's at the backyard. For meeting. For meeting? Yes. Ah, uh -uh. is it bad that? It is worse than that. Come on, come and show me. Just go to the backyard. The backyard. Please talk to her. Let's know how to solve this problem because I, I am tired. I don't know what else to do. I don't know what else to do. Please help me convince her to tell you the truth. <sighs> <coughs> What's wrong with you? <coughs> so, this is true. What your sister is telling me is true, right? Peace. Hey. Wait. Wait. I don't understand. Why is my sister raising unnecessary dust over my illness? Is she alright or is she senseless? What is wrong with her? Why won't she? When you refuse to go to the hospital or take your drugs, why won't she? Hey, so that's why she'll be making my health condition a general, a public announcement. So she's going up and down and be telling people. It's not a public affair, Aguaya. What kind of nonsense is this now? Why is that my second no use her head? So, I'm not a public affair. Me, Joyce, right? <laughs> Please, 
joy. I will not have you insult me. Did you hear me? This is just a simple illness that will come and go. Can't they understand? Then you have to open up to them. Open up to them. Let them stop stressing themselves about you. What is wrong with you? Let them know that the sickness will come and go. Yes. My sister that is because of all these things, but no problem. Speak on my friend. I'm begging you in the name of God. Right now, I need it. enough rest. I don't have time for all these things. I beg. Just wrap Marga. Let me deal with what is wrong with me. Hello, why are you making me feel sick now? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Please, as Antiakudo, as much as possible, a doctor must be arranged to check on peace. Even if it's to bring the doctor here. What do you say? Yes, you're right. I buy that idea. Because delay is dangerous. Hmm? Uh, my love, if you agree with what she said, it's okay by me. But you should understand what comes with it. Of course I do. I'm, I'm not a child. I'll have to do the needful. Then I, I expect you to do something immediately. Of course I will. I will. I have to take my leave now, okay? <laughs> so I'll just put things together. <sighs> Are you sure appendicitis has not busted inside my sister's stomach as a result of the constant vomiting? No, 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 no. Let's not base on presumption. Let's await the doctor's report to avoid self-medication. You know the ugly and negative reputation that will come to us if peace eventually dies in this house. God forbid. And that will be in addition to the stigmatization I already faced because of the accusation of, of, of my useless husband. Thank God you understand my fear. That is why we have to do everything humanly possible to make sure that does not happen. You see this one? I agree with you. Eh? Anything you want to do or you feel we should do to douse this situation, I am all for it. Well, sister, I am suggesting we go out there, look for a doctor that we can convince to come back to this house and take care of her here, since she has refused to go to the hospital with us now. Hmm. That won't be a bad idea. There's no problem. Hmm? If you can arrange it, arrange it. Don't worry about the bills. I'll pay. Ah. I'll foot the bills. Cash oh. madam. The problem now is finding a doctor that will agree to come. Ha! Mbakwa. Don't come with any excuse now. Take it up as a challenge. Search for a doctor frantically. Because life is very important. And the more we waste time, the more things are there, maybe. Eh? I mean, what, what will it take? Or in fact, you can also devise a language that you will use to convince that your sister-in-law to go to the hospital. That is another option. What do you think? What other language will I use? Is it Chinese? Uh -huh. eh? So, no, find know. a doctor. Is all how go culture? Just find a doctor. Name, tell him to name his price and bring him here. Ah. Uh -uh. If Cash you only madam. take money, Amundia, everybody Cash has price. Madam. Even if you like, go to a military hospital, self okay. or a government hospital. Eh. Meet their chief consultant. Just ask him to name his price. He will follow you to this place. Hey, go name. It's alright. I'll see what ah. I can do. Please. My sister has agreed to foot your bills. Either ways, you choose a way to go about your health issues. 
What do you mean by either way? And I don't understand. Why are you all blowing this out of proportion? Why? I am sick and tired of this love and care. You are choking me. You are suffocating me. Can you please stop being self-centered? Why do you care about just yourself? You don't care about any other person around you. Why are you doing this? Yes, we are blowing things out of proportion because we love and care about you. You call this love? Can't you see? Please. Peace, we are one in this family. And one's pain is for everyone. So just, 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 just stop with this. This is your attitude. You stop. You should stop patronizing me. What kind of a thing is this? You're choking me, can't you see? Oh. <laughs> oh, can do? I am only worried and concerned about you because of my wife's health. If not, I would have left you to your feet. After all, you're old enough to take care of yourself. Exactly, exactly. I am old enough to take care of myself. So you push, just let me be. Give me a break. We are not going to give you any break until you get back on your feet. Peace. What do you mean? Are you forgetting your life is in our hands? <laughs> My life is in your hands. As what? As Chukwu Kikabi Omanono. Oburiyano. Chineke bine ni guwa kodoyana akonani. My life is in your people's hands. You push it, just let me be. Apuno maga. Have you forgotten that before you came to stay with us, we had to take excuse from your uncle? What are we supposed to tell him if something happens to you? Peace, Choy Latam. Or I'm looking on him, not be so in that I'm busy. Church is a more busy. Oh, if I may, you want if I may. Hey, you could do. You're used to crying, everything will be crying, everything will be shaking. You can never be strong. Eh, see, my in law, because I do not for chinking now. You know, if this is the case, I would rather go back to my uncle's house where I have my peace. Insanity! I am tired! I am tired! Is that what you're saying, please? Yes! Is this what you're saying? It's alright though. Ah. Would you leave me? It's Everybody, right. peace, 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 peace! Just why are you wicked? Why are you like this? Why are you like this? Peace, peace! We have agreed that we will let you rest. But before that, permit me to ask you one more time. Okay, for the last time. Can I get you something to eat? Akudo. Are you now? Are you not busy? Are you not babysitting me? You, you know that is not possible. Yeah. How is that even possible? I am worried. I am so worried because ever since this illness started, you've been starving yourself. And do you know what it could cause at the long term? You don't give up, do you? How do you expect me to give up? How can I give up when my only sister is languishing in an undisclosed pain and unknown sickness? Kudo. It, it's not as if I'm hiding anything from you. It's just that. It's just that I do not see this sickness. For something that is so serious. Then allow yourself to be taken to the hospital. I don't want to bother anybody. Let's take you to the hospital then. Or better still, agree. Permit us to bring a doctor to the house to check you up. <coughs> Please. <coughs> this is exactly what I'm saying. Honestly, I, I can't take this anymore. I can't. I cannot take it any longer. I can't just take this any longer.
Elakudo, don't tell me that under this prevailing situation and condition that either Amifle or somebody else lay a finger on you. Who beat you? And why are you crying? Uncle, nobody laid fingers on me. Nobody laid fingers on me, but my world is crumbling. My life is wrecked as I speak to you. Why is your life at danger? What is the problem? What is it that is disturbing you? Or do you think that I have the whole day? If you don't want to talk, I will call this phone. I don't, I don't, I don't have your time. I will have the time of listening to your background and crying. I don't bloody care. Uncle, I'm sorry. Oh. I'm sorry. But please allow me to pour out my bitter heart. My heart is heavy. <laughs> Uncle, as we speak, Peace is seriously ill. And the problem is that she has refused to go to the hospital. She doesn't even want to take any drugs. Wait, is that why you're crying? Peace is sick and has refused to take drugs. Then allow her to die if it is what she wish. Stop crying. Eh? Huh? What a nonsense. Allow her to die now. I, wait, let me call her. Uh, uncle. Uncle, how can you say she will allow my sister to die? My only sister. How can I allow my only sister to die? This is not making things easy for me. She's just making everything difficult. <laughs> Shadowing your your views or opinions. And I'm wrong, man. Nkeru, I am too big for this remarks of yours. No, would I have clapped that peace is sick and I refuse to go to the hospitals uh, or take drugs? Is it good? Uh, no, that is not what I'm saying. Eh? Eh, all I'm trying to say here is that you see, sometimes you may have a good case. Eh? Mana, because of hot, uh, uh, you know, hot temper, the case will be judged against you. Yes, if it will be decided against okay, you. Okay, wise woman, can I clap hands for peace for refusing to go to listen to me? If peace die out of her own negligence, her course will never cross here, and she <laughs> will never be buried here. This is what I said. Now I come out of there. No, let's not even go there. No. Eh? Because no. <laughs> hence, no one is wishing her dead. Because if she's brought here now. You cannot stop her to be buried in her own late father's portion in this compound. Wise woman, that particular day, you will be in front to show the homeowners where this father's portion is in this compound. No, you will do the... the, the, the you, will show, you, you will be the person showing them. See, see, let the truth be told. Eh? You know, truth is bitter. Eh? As the only father they are seeing now, Akud and Peace is seeing now, all the was very, very important. Yes, it is very important you call. To uh, know how she is faring, know how your niece is faring, or better still, go and see her, what the situation is like. Pico. Okay, and you eh? think that if I should go there, it will remedy the situation? Of course. Mm. It's okay. At least if uh, peace know that you are aware of what is happening, eh? You see, a joy, she will come down and you know, because over at peace, if peace know that you are aware of what is happening, fear will not allow her to disobey any worse. Yes, it's okay. Okay, why is woman equim? It's okay now. Uh -huh. Or will you carry me to the place? Uh -huh. Huh? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> 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 Why are you 
crying. What did Uncle Onadike say to you that is making you cry? <laughs> Talk to me. What is it? Uncle, Uncle, Uncle called me. And it was me. Calling me on sort of days. Saying that, that if I die, that he would never allow my corpse to be buried in our father's compound. How can you say that to me? Can you now see? Can you see how all of us are feeling because of this sudden sickness of yours? Can you? <laughs> I know, I know it's not simple, I'm hiding anything from you, I'm just, uh, it's, uh, uh, you see this sickness, I just want to die and go, and have rest, let me have rest, I'm tired, what are you saying? <laughs> What are you saying, please? <laughs> Have you ever thought of what will happen to me without you? Do you know that I can as well take my life? Do you know? Okay, tell me. Why do you want to die? Please, why do you want to die? What is this in that world? What is it now? <laughs> As a good friend of this family, your sister called me and she narrated everything to me. I decided to come and see you. Evangelist John, thank you for coming. You're welcome. But if I may ask, what did my sister tell you is the problem? Akudo called me. She said you've been sick and you refuse to take drugs. Is it true? Evangelist John, I'm sick and tired of all this kind of love. What nonsense and stupid kind of love and care is this? Am I a child? Don't I know what I want for myself? Why are they bugging me? They are putting what kind of vehicle is this? Sister Peace. There is something you are not getting. See, let me tell you. Your people love you so much. Something happened in the Bible. In the book of John 3, 16, the Bible made us to understand. For God so loved the hey, world. Hey, stop. Stop, please. What is all this now? So what do you want me to do, Evangelist? Hallelujah. What do you want me to do in this situation? There is nothing too hard for God to do. Sister Peace, there is nothing too hard for God to do. We have to pray. And I believe after praying, the Lord will give you direction. He will direct you on what to do. Let's pray. Sister Kudu, I'm assuring you, the living God is at work. Cheer up! Man of God, hmm? I am worried. 
I am so worried because peace is the only relation I have left. And if anything happens Stop to her... Stop that! Nothing will happen to her. Her sickness is not unto death. It shall end in praise, okay? I hope so. Yeah. I pray so too. Because peace has indirectly wounded me in the heart. If she were not to be my sister, I would have abandoned her and continued with my life. Because this stress is too much for me. I know, Sister Kudo. See, let me tell you. There is nothing the Lord cannot do. Hmm? I'm assuring you, God is at work. According to the Bible, the Bible made us to understand in the book of 2 Chronicles 2020, Ye that believe the word shall prosper, and ye that believe his prophets shall establish. I believe you, man of God. I believe you. Sister Kudo, oh I have ministration in my ministry by 12 noon. I think it's almost time. So, I have to be on my way. Thank you so much for your time and prayers, man of God. You are welcome. Thank you. You are welcome. Uh, won't you wait to at least have some water? Sister Kudo, may the Lord bless you so much. Amen. You are blessed. Amen. Don't worry. Mm, maybe when I come next time, hmm, I have to rush so that I will attend to that oh. administration. Thank you so much, sir. You are welcome. Let me be on my way. Oh, thank eh, you. Up, not the Lord be with you. And also with you. Amen. Eh? Thank you, sir. You are welcome. You, sir. Take care. Please keep praying for my sister and I. Now, well. And always remember to pray at your own time. Alright. Take care. Eh? Thank you, sir. You are welcome. Bye bye, sir. <laughs> your uncle will always laugh at your worry, saying that you don't have enough things. <laughs> <laughs> and Tomakego, don't mind my uncle. He always says that whenever he notices that I have been choked with too many worries. Oh, that means he's a true evangelist. He's a motivator. Because he does that so that you can learn to hold fast onto your faith. Hmm? If you ask me, frankly speaking, you should believe what you said your evangelist told you. And Tumakego, how can everything end in praise when my sister is dying silently? Listen, I will want you to stop worrying. Stop worrying. Huh? If we go back to that hospital and they say your BP has risen, I will withdraw my assistance soon. Huh? There's no cotton to that now. Yeah? Please, you should not withdraw your assistance. So, because if you do, that means I will go back to square one. And that alone will kill me even faster than my sister's illness. Yeah. You must learn to accept what the evangelist told you. Okay? Listen, it must surely end in praise. Every problem has an expiry date. Are you trying to tell me that my sister's sickness will one day become history? Of course now. What are you There must be light at the end of the tunnel. Inania, cheer up. Hmm? Are you very good? Um, Joyce. Uh-huh. Don't give me your... I just want to ask you a question. You know, the same person where they ask questions, you know, they miss road. Um, hope all is well with your friend, please. My friend. Why are you asking? Nothing. I just ask, as a loving and caring neighbor, you know, this her sudden illness after making out with her lover, Peter, it's becoming the village headline. 
caring and lovely neighbor. Yes. And why won't you walk up to her to know what is wrong with her? Eh? It's okay now, please. Uh -uh. Don't misunderstand me. Don't misinterpret me at all. I mean no harm now. You are her bosom friend and you will know better. So that's why I needed to ask. I, I, I mean no harm. Destiny. Stop gossip. It's not good for you. Eh? Hey. Yeah. Uh, thank you very much for the advice. Thank you. But uh, it's just that this has sudden regular vomiting and spitting. It's somehow uh, I don't know, but thank you. Eh? If I get uh, thank you. You are new girl. Yeah. You. This I don't understand. Why would you cut it as you do? Huh? So it is now on fence or wrong for you to tell me something that is wrong with your head. No, let me ask you, why would they love us? Why are we into a relationship if you can be hiding things from me? No, tell me! Frankly, Peter, it's because I know that it's something I can handle. Yes, I don't want to, you know, bother you or bug anybody with my situation. I can handle it. Ah, you can handle it. Now, if I may ask you, how far and how well have you handled it yourself? What has been the outcome? No, tell me! Oh, so you want people to start telling me that I couldn't take my girlfriend to the hospital? Or how many privation they will say that I'll use you for money ritual? Is that what, what you want to tell me? Stop it. Stop. Yes, Peter, I am not in the mood for this shouting and And I will shout at you as much as I want. Yes, you are not behaving like a mature woman. You are behaving like a kid. You are not behaving your age. And I need to shout at you if that's what will correct your brain. Yes! Now, listen. I don't have all this time. You will go in there, get dressed up, and take you to the hospital for proper treatment. Yes! I say go in there. Go can dry everyone away. Are you sure you saw peace yourself? And you both discussed, and then she agreed to follow you to the hospital. Mother Kudo, you are like drunk or stupid. Huh? I was with peace 30 minutes ago. We discussed that let her go in there and dress up so that I can take her to the hospital for a proper checkup. And she accepted. And up to now, she's not yet at. Hey, never funny well. I did not say you were drunk. Neither did I say you were stupid. I only asked my question because peace is nowhere to be found. What? Yes. I'm just coming from the backyard. She is not there. Even inside the house, she's not there. Does it mean that peace is possessed? Or possibly trying to avoid visiting the doctor? I don't know. I am only happy that God has vindicated me. Because it's happening right before you. You people will think that I don't want to take her to the hospital. Then God is happening to you too. Mother Kudo, if I find out that peace is making caricature of me, I will take this easy with her. I swear to God. You will not like me. What I will do to peace, you will not like it. Don't tell me to take it easy. Calm down. This is what you see when you are in love. Any man in love must learn to tolerate. You accept some certain things. See, I am the last man that a woman will talk with his emotions like this. I won't take it. I'm an African man. I won't allow a woman to talk with my emotions. In fact, I'm done with this. I'm going. Don't tell me to calm down, please. Calm down. What sort of problem is this? In fact, I'm done. No, this is a to a man. Eh? I am an African man and I will not allow a woman to talk with my emotions. What is all this? If she's not ready to see the doctor, let her die in silence. If you keep breaking up like this, before I marry you, we date three women in a year. People, calm down. Eh? Things are not done like that. You need to learn how to tolerate. Now, Biko, Biko, I'm begging you, please. Melo down, wait to Obi. Oh, no, okay, cable. Don't worry, I will find her and I will tell her to come and see you. Biko, oh, na. Hey. We are one Now against me. 
Oh, my mistake. I regretted ever doing and I rejected it. And I refused. But my in law here did not agree. I don't hear any way saying that Ahami is responsible. Yes. How? I, I, what, what, what is she saying now? What how? is how? Responsible for what? What, what? what are you saying now? When you were doing it, did you not know you're saying how? Are she still talking of Be the head of the world. You should be ashamed of it. What a betrayer. How can you betray your sister like this? Eh? How can? Are you okay? Is Kwanyaga, are you okay? That's what I want to know. Because you cannot be okay and do what you did. I don't even know what came over me. Even though he overpowered me. Come on, close that your silly mouth or sweet song. What you put your retina can go? What do you mean by that? No, I'm asking you. You were in a wrestling match and he overpowered you. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Eh? Your sister has been prayerfully going around the whole place looking for a solution to her infertility. And all the support she could get from her own sister is for you to go and get pregnant for her, for, for her husband. It seems he overpowered you. Overpowered you. And no fear. Look at you. No! Oh, poor. He's a Opua, Ijaye, Mrs. Jagerson. Eh? Why can I go kill you? Useless girl. You are very stupid. Ask what was. Ask what was. Hi. I see one guy is going to go to me. You was just, I don't know the temptation. No. I don't know if that's if I'm trying to prove my innocence. Because I know that I have wronged my parents, my late parents. I've even robbed myself and I robbed my own sister. My blood, all I'm asking for is forgiveness, please. Yeah. Not Nanya, come back. I am not moved with that crocodile tears. If you had cried like this, then this, uh, 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 that day, this thing will not have happened. So I'm not moved. Let me tell you something. If you don't know how to pray, let her go and learn it now. You will need it. Learn it now. Because if anything happens to Akudo, eh? You are dead. Hey. How can? How can you? How can you find your own brother-in-law that is supposed to be like a brother to you? Attractive. And for, is that, to the extent that you are comfortable enough to open your legs for him. Hey, who has to do the man? Who do the man? Who do the man? Who do the man? Who do the man? I swear, you do the man. Who do the man? 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 Eh, I just only want you twice now. This is the third one. Just nigga didn't even put you like a gym general market, gym hold on, a gym pick to my yak, they really have almost can't. I said I'm tired. I don't want to play this thing again. Eh? You don't want to rest. Oh, come because you know, eh, because you know, come on, 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 come General market, go away. Come, come. Eh? Touch, touch me again like that. Eh, hey, where are you not again? No, no, no. I, just touch me. Okay. Your hand is so soft. I, I like it. <laughs> oh, well, you're very funny. Is my hand softer than that of my sister? I'm not, I'm not talking about your sister here. Yeah. I just, I don't know. I just felt something. Oh, go Pico, just wait. Now let's finish this game. Go and play. <laughs> Just touch me now. I you want to play, touch me. I should touch you. Just, just the way you, you know. So if I touch you, you play with you? Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Are you okay now? Eh? I'm going to talk you with that. Eh? <laughs> I touch everywhere. Is this a okay? Hi, Uncle. Oh, okay. Why are you telling me to touch everywhere here? Uncle, <laughs> let's continue. Eh? 
Please, I'm sorry. Alright? I'm sorry. Say that now. Why would I want to rip you? So please don't call it rip. Okay? Listen, listen, please. I love you. Okay? I've loved you from the very first day I set my eyes on you. I'm sorry I let my I let loss take over me. I'm so sorry. General market. Who needs it? And general market. And up here. Who needs Kobe Power Hotels? Eh? Oka Kobe. Go here now. Not one good thing. I have told you my own. As for Horace, you are shameless. You don't have a conscience, and you are very wicked. You are one of the most unstable, unreliable, and unfaithful fellow I have met. How dare you? How dare you involve yourself in such a welcome that? Let me your own sister in law. Ishwanya, are you okay? That is not my fault. You, you don't understand this thing. It's not my fault. It's the devil's fault. It's your Yes, now. You, you, you're, you're saying this thing as if this is what I used to do every day in this house. No. We were just playing like we used to play, like brothers and sisters. And then all of a sudden, the, 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 the whole urge overwhelmed me and I. I, 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 I so, I not you know, sir. You're a big fool. You're a goat. I used to think that. Okay, but now that I know that you are, I, 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 I'm okay. That is what you are. Oh, this is the devil's work. The devil has cut you up here. Yeah? Everyone is so quarrel, quarrel, why not tell them why? And then you were so rangy that your brain did not register that the person you are about to climb or climbed is your sister in law. She like, oh my god, you are a goat. Yes, sister, I'm a goat. I'm a malu. I'm a cow. That's what you want to call me. He may tell you where he no. You are that and more. Sister, sister, if you want to kill me, kill me. I'm guilty of this thing. Yes, it has happened, it has happened. But please, I want you to help me appease my wife. Reassure her of my love for her now. Eh? Okay, be. In Abara, you want to appease your wife? Muki, yes, and to go and appease your wife, Okuya? Okay. If that is what you want, then you have to make sure that that pregnancy is terminated. That is the only way peace will reign. And normalcy will come back to your relationship. Sister, abortion. That, uh, that, that is killing, killing another human being. I'm okay, Nadja. That is killing another human being. Oh, you don't know you have killed your wife. I'm okay, Nadja. You see me, Sister, come now. Sister, come now. Sister, come now. Sister, where are you going to now? Come now, let's finish this plan. Sister! Hey! It's a hacking, I don't understand. You don't understand. I just feel like running away. I feel like running into the desert, living there with the white creatures. Excommunicate myself from human beings. I believe that I will find peace there. There is no peace anywhere. The only place you can find peace is deep within your soul. And for that to happen, you have to find it in your heart. Find a place in your heart to forgive them. Forgive them. Okay, God, did you say forgive them? When my younger sister is pregnant for my husband. Can't you see? Peace will be valued, respected, preferred over me. 
I will be as useless as nothing in this house. It's okay. Get Listen. If that pregnancy is going to be a problem, hmm, you have two options. One, terminate it. And I don't support it. I am strongly against it. Two, you can find a way to make peace pin that pregnancy on Peter. Okwebe. Hmm? Think about it. No! I don't get it. I'll get it, Emeba! This is a case of a dog eating a bone hung on his neck. Abefula! This is a total betrayer. You didn't try at all. What you go? He did not try. He did not try. And the worst part is that I am at a crossroad now. This case is not as simple as it looks. It has a lot of complexities. One, peace is already engaged. So we have Peter to contend with. Two, how do we now handle that dear, poor, some and bitter uncle? Hey, Nadike! Nadike! Hey! I don't even know why we are all fighting ourselves because of this. This is a very simple issue now. Okay. Eh? Ah. She, Peter, uh, her husband to be, said he wants her to get pregnant before they get married. And let us just push this thing on him and then everything is settled. This is a very simple thing, Chikena. You are a tricky goat. That is what you are. Aran, again, I will see. Aran, on your head, we see. Imagine, oh, you want to transfer the pregnancy. Mba, no text message. Let me give you a recharge card so you can transfer the pregnancy to another man. Why can't you? Why can't you? This boy is senseless. Very senseless. I'm a fool. You are a fool. Big one. In fact, I feel like squeezing you now. I'm a fool. You are a disgrace to this family. How can you impregnate your sister in law, Abefula? In a puala! Hey! I'm dead. What can I go? What do I do now? I don't know. Because in his head, he thinks it's very easy. Eh? Only securing a meeting with that mad uncle of yours is a big, big problem. We won't be for me. The very day she collided with Ahame Fula to sleep together to my detriment and shame marked the last day of our bloodline. We won't be for me. It was all, it was all a mistake. It was all a mistake. And I'm ready. I am ready to do anything whatsoever. I am ready to do everything to assure you that I meant no evil. I meant no evil one name. I meant no you evil. Are wicked. You are very mad for saying this. <laughs> You meant no evil, yet you opened your legs. Peace, you pulled off your pants, opened your legs for my husband to sleep with you. And you have the guts to open this gutter of yours to say that you meant no evil. Can't you see? You are self-centered, mindless and wicked. Oh. I regret everything. I regret ever calling you my blood. No. I regret. I regret ever having you as a sister. No. All this. All this, all this was just an accident. I am tired of hearing this nonsense. What are you saying? I'm sorry. What are you telling me? I am ready to go to anywhere. Oh, this was out of my 
my control. I swear to God, you made me. There is no way I could hurt my own sister. My blood, oh, Barabo. Oh, Barabo. I am so sorry, sister. I am ready. I am ready to leave your house. I am ready to go far away. I am ready to leave you, leave your relation and everybody. And whatever I choose to do with this pregnancy, I would never ever call you or your husband or anybody. You are talking absolute nonsense. I'm sorry. You are a snitch. You are wicked! You are a poison! I love you. I don't want to I don't want to eat it! Oh God! You know what? To hell with you! To hell with your love! To hell with everything that has to do with you! You are a hypocrite! Leave me! Just wanting to catch up with you. Oh. So catch up with me. Oh, yes. No problem. No problem at all. Um, Joyce, mm -hmm. um, don't see me as a gossip over what I want to ask you. Yeah. Go on and save my precious time. <clears throat> my dear. Hey! <laughs> okay, <laughs> my dear. Oh. <laughs> you know, I saw Peter today. He was backing. Fuming! He was threatening! Hey! I hope he's not trying to deny responsibility. What responsibility are you talking about? Ha! Why are you pretending as if you don't know what I'm talking about? Responsibility of this regular vomiting! Yeah, yeah. Destiny, hmm? where are you sent? Ah, uh -uh. sent how? I don't understand. See, go and tell whosoever that sent you that you people are too small to spare on me. And next time you try this rubbish. talked to Akodo here so that she can see reasons for her to make peace with her sister and manage the situation even though we all know it's very ugly and she has accepted um, that is why we have also come to to see you uh, yes uncle I I want us to fashion a way to amend pending issues the damage has already been done. We can't throw the poor girl into the street. Ah, Mefuna! Ogum. Now go ahead and clap for your free self for carefully doing this damage to my niece, thereby bringing shame and reproach to this family. Now go ahead! I'm very angry. Uncle Nadike, please calm down. I understand how you feel, but I have cried my eyes out and I have accepted the oh, situation. Oh, I said shut up. What did you accept? Are you mad? What do you know about tradition? What do you know? Peace is the only sister I have. She is all I have. And I cannot throw her away. So I have forgiven and accepted her. Oh God, this is the reason we have to accommodate her. She can't do without her now. That's the reason we have to accommodate her. Please. Ah, Mefuna. 
I can see that you're a born cheat and tricker. You are a born cheat and tricker. Look at you. Look at you. If I may ask, how many women do you marry from this family? How many? Answer me. No, no, don't, don't, don't tell me that. It is okay. That is why we are here, so that we can do the needful. Matego, Matego. Uh, we just want to seek your consent. My consent. My consent has to cheat this family. That by bringing disrespect and dishonor to this family. Listen to me. By the time I go in there and come out, if you don't live here, if, by the time I go in there, I'll do the damage. I don't want to. Leave. If you come there, you got your cheese gacha. You better leave. See the rap, Lucian. Can you imagine? Okay, okay, okay. This rap is free. I'm not a problem. We are one being for me. Something I want to tell you. Yeah? You see, which uh, which If you ask me, uh, if you ask my own opinion, I will say you should give her family your consent, so that you will take uh, our daughter, please, as a second wife. Who knows? That could be his last resort. Eh? Check. Ikiru. So by so doing, I will not be merchandising the daughters of my late brother. Is it not true? Mm -mm. No, please. You just see it uh, from the logical angle. Eh? It, it, it will, will it be better that uh, our daughter peace is roaming the streets with pregnancy or the man. Eh? Why the man in question, the man that is responsible, eh, is even suffering uh, childlessness in his house? Check in your name, check in your name, or the man like that. Woman, may I warn you for the last time? Desist from interfering into traditional and customary matters because you don't know anything about them. Now, if I should give my consent for Ahimefuna to take peace as a second wife, what will happen to Peter, that young man who came here seeking for peace and the marriage? What will happen to him? I am your wife. Sometimes you hit my advice. I rub my together. Let me tell you, no man is monopoly of knowledge. No, no, I have never seen. Peter's fate can be decided. Can be decided by you. No, you will decide it. Nkiru. I say I will not give my consent and I need to be left alone. Will you do that? Can you leave me alone? I say, leave, leave me alone. I will not. I said I will not over my dead body would I do that. Nah, think about it. Think about it. Nonsense. Think about it. Cheats. Idiots. You can be careful. Though. Ah, what you The rich people are really enjoying. <laughs> this brandy brings me back to life. <laughs> hey! If I'm taking this kind of branding every day, I'll be looking younger. <laughs> in that case, Uncle, yes. I have more. When you're done, I'll be, in fact, Uncle, when you're leaving, I will package one for you. Hey, what can go? Thank you very much. Hey! Thank you. Very much. Hey. <laughs> Thank you. Uh -huh. But, uh, Uncle, hmm? you know you are the only one that can salvage this situation and douse this tension that is rising up. Uh, where can he go? You see, I will try my best. No, so, you see, this is like touching the tiger by the tail. For Ina DK, he had not to crack. <laughs> yes. We all know him. We know what he can do. And we know his personality. But let me also remind you that no matter how hot a man's anger is, he cannot light fire. He cannot light stove. Do you understand? So call a meeting, sit him down, and talk things over with him man to man. I believe, you know, 
we will come to a conclusion. Mm, you see, eh, where can you go? I condemn in strong terms. Oh, yes. Ah, Amir Fuller's attitude of impregnating his sister in law is outrageous and barbaric. What nonsense? Eh, I know. But well, let's just take it that he made a mistake. Ah. Or that it is also the will of the gods. Mm -hmm. I disagree. Your theory. Yes. You see, this is a case of a dog eating a bone hung on his neck for protection. Why don't we, first of all, rescue the cock from the clutches of the kite? Then later we call the cock and blame it very well for walking into the wide view of the kite. Uh, hmm? How can you see me? Uh, okay, go. This might be difficult. Mm. Yes. But uh, you see, I need you to back me up with your prayers. Mm -hmm. Because from my previous encounter with Nadiki, he's a dangerous man. Mm. Very dangerous. It is your brother's lineage that we are talking about. Your brother's lineage. So, if you do not want your brother's lineage to close, we have to take this opportunity. We have to seize this opportunity. Uh -uh. You're my family. Eh, uh, I'm um, but where can you go? Does it mean that you've written off the possibility of Akudos getting pregnant? Ah, no. Have you? Mm -mm, I did not say that. But you know that say a better kind. The water. Kaiji they go do guy for. Let us hold the one that is on ground. Eh, hey, then later, anytime she decides to give birth, eh, hey, we'll take that one. At least. We have one already. Check here, Nianu. Walk ego. Check here, yeah. Indeed, a bad hand. Wow. Hey! You are very wise. <laughs> Mama, I've been wanting to visit peace at her in law's place. But I'm afraid of that woman, Walk ego. And I'm not ready for her investigative interrogations. <laughs> Hi. So, if I may ask, why is everybody afraid of Wakego? Who in her real life she's a friendly person? Eh? Mama, you are the very first person to say that Wakego is friendly. Eh? To you as an in-law, she might be friendly, but to others, she's a Jezebel. Indeed. It's surprising, you know. So, so what do I attribute your visit? Mm, I I just wanted to know if you have been seeing or hearing from Peace. And how is she? <laughs> well, she is fine. As you know, one could be sick in a day and it takes time to heal. Yes. That's true. Um, how about her regular spitting and vomiting? I just subsided too. Uh, she's fine. Mm. Mm, she's very, very fine. You know, at some point I was thinking that maybe appendicitis might have boosted inside her tummy. Mm -hmm. uh, but maybe my guess was not correct. Mm -hmm. well, she's fine. Mm -hmm. I am busy inside. No go. Uh, Mama, see, eh, please advise her to be taking bitter cola. Yeah. Very well. If possible, she should add bitter leaf. It will help her. Yeah. Yes, Mama. No go. Uh, bitter cola. I have something to do inside. Oh. Uh, no go. We are one being for me Okay, Ken, Nadiki. Oh, <laughs> you see, you have every reason to be angry. But all I'm saying is that, please, before you destroy the house you built, consider the negative implications. Be good. So, um, Ofomado, imperatively, what are you insinuating under this situation? What I'm saying is that we should use our wisdom as two elders, you know, and uh, handle this issue. I mean, and share 
what we have in the treasure bag. And why must you refer it as treasure bag? Have you just come to make mockery of me under this situation? Contrary to that, Nadike. You see, if I do such things, then I'm no longer worthy to be called an elder. Let us take everything that bites at night as bed bug. Afamado, the question is, how many bed bugs did we negotiate and bet for? Uh, initially, it was one. Mm -hmm. Nadike. But uh, the next one has what the former hasn't. So, let's internally pray. Because uh, we are aiming to score in the same goal post. This is my own candid advice. We go. Okay. In that matter, of format, I will think about it and I will invite you over. Please, uh, the earlier the better, Nadike. Because the journey of nine months starts with one and a half. We go. There will be no problem about that. You can take some Okay, Kay, Nadiki. Take some heart. Uh, thank you very much. My love. Uh -huh. Thank you so much for your assistance. Wallahi, your assistance in this job is second to none. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly. Give me I the would like to help. Thank you. Uh, we need to make the baby of the house look very beautiful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Baby of the house? Yes. <laughs> and who is the baby of the house? You, of course. Yeah, I'm I'm not the baby of the house though. See the baby of the house here. <laughs> well, until that baby arrives, you are the baby of this house. <laughs> Supported. Uh, ah, case closed. <laughs> no more case. <laughs> it's that good though. Eh? I don't know where to start from. I want to say a big thank you to you for your love, your understanding, and your forgiveness. God will bless you. Amen. <laughs> I'm happy to have you as my sister. I'm happy to have you too as a sister. <laughs> <laughs> your hair is fine. Yeah, I'm looking so beautiful. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. My love. Baby. Thank you so much for your understanding. Mm. Thank you for forgiving peace and myself. Come on, baby. Why are you bringing up the past event? Wow. I have since forgiven and forgotten everything. All I want is for peace to be. That is it. And may God bless this family. Amen. Amen. <laughs> <sighs> so, what you're trying to tell me now is that I have two wives. <laughs> <laughs> Stop! What's this? Uh, <laughs> Stop. I'm enjoying it anyway. You eat a water. You eat a good Stop. Stop. Go inside. Oh you see, mm -hmm. so oh, I rub my back, especially my waist. Okay, anything for you. Get washer. Washer. Bit of my Oh, the weather is very hot. So. You no, know, we like it when the weather is hot. It cleans the, the, the what you call the kidney. Yeah. Uh, thank you very much. So, um, Peter, no. Thank you. Yeah. Traditionally, the day you came here asking for peace and marriage, I told you that I was going to interview her. And that I've done. Peace, who is here, rejected your proposal. What? Peace, how? You and I formalize our wedding plans and you accepted my proposal then i brought a drink for your uncle so why are you saying no you're right 
I accepted your proposal, right? Yeah, I changed my mind too. Yes, I had a rethink. So after that, I made up my mind that um, this is not going to work. So I don't want to marry you. I'm sorry. Peter, Nabigo, take it as one of those things. You know, marriage is supposed to be a thing of mutual agreement. Yeah. You don't force someone into marrying you. You cannot force her. Biko, oh? My son, you see, there are other girls out there. Eh? You can choose one and marry. Eh? See, a broken relationship is better than a broken marriage. What is it? Uh -huh. So, it's better call off now. Mm. Eh? It's, better, it's better the call off happened now. Mm. And let her put yourself together and move on. Oh, mom. Eh? Kiro, give me that piece of water. Give it to me. Oh, yeah. Ha, Peter, mom. Traditionally, what I'm doing now is wrong. But based on the person I am and my reputation in this community, this is the drink you brought that day. It's Omega. I announced it that day. This is the lilac you use in bringing it. So you can check with the carton, mm. the expiring date, and the same landlord you brought it with. Mm. I think I gave it to you to keep. Oh. Uh, you should not decay. With all due respect, I'm not going to accept this drink from you. Now or ever. Hi. Yeah, me? Ah, uh, as for peace, I wish you good luck. Well, calm down now. Yeah, you can't give away, baby. Peter, oh, hang on. Peter! Oh, hang on. Oh, it's so sad. I'm sorry. 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 i am sorry i and as these two beautiful sisters are going to be Ahame Fuller's wives, <laughs> I pray that Chuko Kikiabiyama confirm and ordain this marriage. You see? So shall it be. You see? <coughs> Uncle. Um, you see, I want to thank you especially for your understanding and also your encouragement. Hmm? I truly appreciate you. As a matter of fact, we all appreciate you. Huh? I'm just doing my application. Yes. Know. Uncle, I will never allow your labor to go in vain. So because of that, I am going to support your first son's business with 500,000 naira. Ask him. I will just start the money. Hey! Wake ego. Wake ego. Cash, madam. You are blessed in the money. Hey! Wake ego. You are blessed in the afternoon. Wake ego. You are blessed in the evening. Say, in fact, you're going out and coming in. You are blessed. Say, I've been very, very, very grateful, Wakaigo. Because I'm a fuller. I could do a new wife, please. Kindly thank Wakaigo for me. <laughs> hey! Thank you so much. Thank you. Hey! Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. God, I thank, thank you. you. Thank you. I am very, 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 very excited. <laughs> hey! Okay. And to triple the excitement and the joy in this house, I want to announce to you all that Akuto here. Is carrying a two months old pregnancy. Hey! Oh my god. Uh, according to this doctor's report, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my 
and sincerely thank you and thank God for restoring peace to this family. I want to thank you especially for accepting peace here to be your co-wife. Mm -hmm. eh? You see you. God will bless you. Amen. God will bless you and your family. Amen. Mm -hmm. God will bless you. Honestly, Auntie, it wasn't easy at all. Come on, come on. But I had no option. After all, a child from peace is also my child. You when the man is for your go, for your go. And once I go to bed, I will hand over this child to you, and the child will call you mommy. <laughs> <laughs> and what would the child call you? <laughs> Me, Auntie Peace. Easier said than done. When, when she gives birth, she will know how far you are. <laughs> anyway, um, I have settled on. I didn't want to say this in front of him. I am um, going to transfer five million to you so that you can reestablish yourself. Hmm? For now. For now. Five million. Please shift this table for me. Let me paint. Here. No, shift the table for me. I want to paint here. Okay, Luna, uh, it, it, that is what I can afford for now. Ima, business is not really Ima good, but this is what I will give you for now. As time goes on, hmm? I will add more. Thank you know, go. Uh, I have uh, so, not even started that you are thanking me. Oh. On behalf of myself and my wives. Mm. <laughs> Why? Thank you. Hmm? No problem. God bless you. Um, I could do you. Because of the kind of woman that you are, I have seen that you are very industrious and um, you are a good woman. I'm going to give you two million. Baby, sit down, sit down, my child. So that you can start something. Thank you. Uh, it is not good for a woman to be idle. I don't support that. That is why, while I was in my husband's house, even with the money he had, I was doing my own thing, small, small. Mm -hmm. At least, even if it's one naira that I have. I know it is my own. That is what I want for you too. Oh? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> and uh, you, I will give you one million. <gasps> you go do card. You are carrying my child. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See, I don't want a repeat of what happened the last time. Carry me. my child and get off from there. I will not even let that be. Uh -huh. I will not let that Sit be. Down. Hmm? It is okay. God bless you. You know an idle mind is the devil's workshop. Uh, so it is better for me to keep all of you busy. Because if you keep your mind idle, then the devil will have chance to come in again and scatter the family again, no and way. I will not allow it. No way, no so way. it's not as if I have too much. Oh, what? For the sake of the peace of this family, I will bring out my last card. So anyhow I can come in, I will still come in. You know very soon I'll be joining my husband and my children. Man of fear, but. I am happy because I know I'll be leaving a peaceful family behind. Hey, Babu, I know if you are calm. For that last card, God forbid. You cannot be your last card. Hey, no. You will have and have and have. You will never lack. Hey, no. And now that you said you are going to be with your children, don't forget. We are also your children. Hey, Mama, Mama. Don't worry. Like, Big I will baby. not allow it to happen. Uh -uh. I, I you. know, me too. I will miss you. <laughs> no, 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 no. When it's time, both of you will come I will to the city. Uh, when the you know, for those you go. And I'll come for you, go. <laughs> 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 